Hello, folks. Welcome to a wrap-up of Prime Day. This has been a day. This is like my first one, like I really mm, <laughs> invested in it. Uh, I know you guys did last year. Does it feel different? I know your your partner, your cohort, is here. It but... is different because last year we went live a lot more, but mm -hmm. between uh, having a you know client work in the middle of the day that you know. Right. And, and, you know, I think it was one of those things where that was booked before Prime Day, where I might oh, have yeah, said, no, I'm not available, but uh, it's a client that's paying. So, you know, I made money regardless. <laughs> of the outcome. That's, that's <laughs> good. That's always good. Yeah. So the, th the funny thing with uh, the, so I always so I looked like I, I think I was one of the first Prime members. Like I've been on it since ni 1999, I think. Whenever it started, I was all in. Back. Back in the day. And so I've always participated in it, but I've never like, you know, actually done stuff. So this has been fun. It's been an adventure. It's a, it's a, a wild time going live takes, you know, at this, it takes a lot out. Yeah. Of it. So, well, it was, it's been fun getting to do it with you too, because, you know, we yeah. kind of like, both were like, Hey, you know, what are we going to do? And yeah, because you know, what we did last year too, is we did a couple shows with other people, which is always mm -hmm. fun. It's kind of collaborating. Cause you know, we have, different things in our carousel but we're able right. to use one stream and I, I i actually like it i think it's it's fun because yeah. i think uh, bounce off each yeah, other like we talked about it um you know at in what is it orlando right yeah yeah um, i don't look at people as competition i don't mean that in a snooty way i think right plenty of products to go around and exactly you know right now there might not be people watching for the products we have and, and that's okay because they'll come back another day and we yeah. you know it's kind of sometimes it's a little bit of a of a crap shoot and of course you know it's funny i know you probably saw some comments it's like where people like you know it looks like there's a bunch of people going live for the first time on i Amazon saw that today, i saw that the, the, yeah. the quality of their uh you know their what stream, the, guess, everybody's got to start somewhere is what i that's was thinking right. you know? I, I and I, I you know we encourage that you know definitely mm -hmm. uh Definitely something we encourage. So you can see I'm wearing my, uh, I have my special shirt on today. It's right. my I'll go full screen uh, on you. Let me see Marine what it is. Corps Forces Command t-shirt. The oh, yellow matches, right? Yeah, that's really so cool. So today, if you didn't see on Facebook, is kind of a, in fact, I, I think they were both Fridays. So on Friday the 13th of July, 1984, I stood on the yellow footprints at Paris Island mm. and started boot camp. And then... July 13th, 2009 was my retirement ceremony. Mm. And I think that might have been a Friday as well. So, you know, so Friday the 13th is not always a bad day. Yeah. Well, well I, I think I, I don't know if I've never told this before, but thank you for your service, man. That's that's really yeah. awesome that you were in. And then I had to figure out something to do. And this <laughs> marketing is the thing. Stuff yeah. came along and marketing has nothing to do with what I, I right. shouldn't say. I had something to do, but uh, we had we had to market. Uh, we had to market how to get money from our higher levels. That was, I guess right. you'd say that was my job. You know, I was always trying to get more money for my, for my boss. And uh, exactly. I think I did okay. So hopefully today we're going to be able to save you money. So this is kind of a thing. So Jim and I, we didn't like plan this out other than, hey, let's talk about this. Let's, let's do a versus show where we scour the prime day deals and specials. And so I don't know what he has. He may have, and I, he don't really know what I have. Uh, so this will be fun. So you want to make sure that you follow both of us. So like if I say something and you don't see it on Jim's carousel, hop over to jeffc.live. Same thing for me. If you don't see it on uh, my carousel and Jim's talking, go jump over there. You know, it's the interwebs. We all know how to go back and forth. You can have both tabs open. Whatever work floats hey, your boat. You know, that's but this is going to be a fun one because I'm interested to see what Jim has found. I spent the afternoon kind of going around going, oh, I have that. That's on sale. That's really cool. So uh, why don't you kick us off, Jim, with what you've got uh, for us? Yeah, so I, I'm going to start out. We, we talked about this yesterday, so it's a, it's a little bit of a – oh, and i got to make sure. I think is, – is my overhead one on? Did I, or did I forget? Let me find out in a second here. Oh, i got to connect my uh, – my okay. camo app back. Hold well, on. Well, let me let me go to to mine then. I'll just go to mine. I'll go full screen to me and uh, talk about my first one. So the thing that um, and I and I once again, it's the best time of. Oops, wrong camera. See, I'm, we're all hitting all sorts of wrong buttons today. This um, this is the the Kindle and this is the Oasis and I I talked about this a couple of streams. Um, 
if you're an e-reader or you're a book reader, this is like the cream of the crop. It's flat on the top. It's it's got um, just really sh- it's the sharpest screen they have. It's got the warm light with it. Um, and this is the final day, folks, for the the Prime Day. So if you've had this, you know, you've had it in your cart for a while, you need to check this out. It's it, the warm light's not really on right now, but you can just see how crisp the uh, the words are. And there's no real like when I switch between the uh, screens here, um, there's not really a big flash like some of the old ones, and it's just very smooth reading. The the Oasis has the physical buttons, but you can also swipe over uh, just like you're used to in your uh, e-readers. And I just love this. It's waterproof. You can take it to the pool or to the ocean. Um, and it, the one that's in my carousel right now actually has the uh, the cover included. It's kind of the bundle deal. And the, the cover is waterproof. It protects the, the corners really, really nicely. And so um, I just, I love the Kindle. If you're a reader, this is like the, you know, you know, treat yourself kind of thing. So that's what, right. I mean, that's what uh, I did one day when my wife was looking the other way. I went and got this and i love it so kindle oasis and it's it's different it's kind of a, it's a seven inch screen it's got this little bump in the back but i like it because it holds you can hold on to it and if you drop it it's not too heavy it won't break your nose like some like my phone i've dropped it on my face sometimes i'm like it's bad it's bad so check it out this is the last day for it i have there's a couple different versions there's a 32 gigabyte version there's a eight gigabyte version i only needed the eight because i can always delete books and add them back later because you can hold a lot of books for eight gigabytes uh, and, and now, do you use? Speaking of that, and I, and it's too bad we can't put the link in the uh, in in our carousels. Do you use Kindle Unlimited? Um, I don't, but when you're a Prime member, you get so many free books anyway. So if any of you guys did, and you still have time if you want to do it, they have a they had this stamp promotion where you would go and like you buy something from Prime, you would get like stamps, and if you would, one of them was checking out a book from the free Kindle library when you're a Prime user. And when you filled out those stamps, you got ten dollars off to use for Prime Day. And I did that, but I've so I have um, some free ones, and they rotate. And you can, I think you can check out ten at a time of the wow. books, and then you when you you know, put one back, That's then right. you can change it's another. Kind of like one. the library, you got to turn them yeah. back in. Yeah, yeah, but it's they have, and it's not like you know old books like Hound of the Baskervilles. You know, and it's yeah. like there's some really good stuff. I read Tiny Habits um, on there that was a free book, and so a lot of great books uh, on kindle but then you can't upgrade to kindle unlimited and right now too which i sh- wish same thing i wish we could put it in there uh there's a lot of audible deals right now if yep. you'd like to listen to books and the cool thing with uh, kindles is you can read for a while and then you can go listen and it has the same spot and then you can go back and read if you wanted to so yeah i i definitely like uh like that i in fact it's funny i i have so many audible credits that every once in a while it's like right you need to buy an audible or you're going to lose your credit i'm like oh yeah you know, so I, I think I did that, but I listened to uh, not Tiny, but Atomic Habits. Yeah, that's a good one. I listened mm-hmm. to that, that on Audible while I was uh, was walking. So that that's oh, uh, yeah. That's and one like. of the things that you can do that I like too is um, I like to highlight stuff in passages. And I have a service that actually and it's called Readwise, and it's just mm-hmm. totally separate. But it lets you what you highlight. It'll actually take that and put it in a database, and it actually will email me those snippets that I've highlighted. So. You don't forget something in a book. You're like, oh, that's right. You know, Mark Schaefer said that in his book or Ross Brand said that. And you get these emails and you can set up for different, you know, uh, things. But I really, I use the note feature in here in inside of here a lot to take notes. Um, but it's just, it's just slick. Um, you can, you know, they even have uh, graphic novels, you know, you can read in here. Um, it's just, I just, I just love it. So, yeah. And, th- and I, and I, I even have the one that's, the ad version, like when you see when I open it up, it usually will have like a ad for a book. You can buy it. Uh, see, it just has an ad that. Uh, uh-huh. That's why you can get the Kindles um, cheaper. The more expensive ones, you can unlock it so you don't see that. It doesn't bother me. Once in a while, I'll see a book that I like, so it's fine. Yeah. So. And they probably know because they either heard you talking and your computer knows, or <laughs> it's from right. your habits. <laughs> and I, I just, and it's funny because, yeah, they do, because I just finished a Dean Koontz book because um, I kind of like him to read every once in a while. So yes. sneaky people. But yeah, yeah, if you have any interest, this is the day. Prime days are when to buy Amazon devices. So make sure you guys check that out. So, okay. Are you ready, Jim, for yours? I, I am now ready for okay. number one. Okay. Yeah, I, I forgot I, I was playing around with my camera earlier. So I'm going to start with, we talked about this yesterday, the Apple Series 7. Mm. This is the 45 
millimeter, so it's a little bit bigger face. And what I love about it is it's about an 18 hour battery. So you literally just like, I think we talked about this yesterday, Jeff, I do the same thing. When I get up in the morning, I stick it on the charger mm -hmm. and it'll usually be charged up by the time I've showered and dressed. But I'm with, I'm like you, I sleep with it because it, it detects sleep, all yeah. the sleeping mm -hmm. patterns. Um, and then, you know, when I hit this button, you can see you got all these apps. One of the things that I've really become a big fan of now, I used to use a Fitbit. Mm -hmm. So this was a big deal for me is, is Apple fitness. Yep. And so not only do I get, you know, the rings and as you can see, I've stood up, Look at you, hours, yeah. got my exercise and hopefully I'll burn enough calories while we're standing here to close my movement. <laughs> there rings. you go. Yeah. Um, but I also like that, you know, when you go here, like to the little fitness thing, you can do all oh, these yeah. workouts. Mm -hmm. And so even when I go to the gym or, or to the Y, I'll be like, okay, I'm doing the elliptical and it tracks it. It tracks my calories. It tracks my heart rate. Right. Um, and, and I'll tell you what was funny. What sold me on this was during the playoffs and maybe it's cause I'm getting older. They had those ads where these people are out like exercising, working out, whatever, and they fell mm. and the watch yeah. would call nine one one or you had the, the guy that was on the paddleboard. Right. Right. But that, uh, you know, he's calling with his watch because he couldn't get to his phone. But the, because yeah. the phone was nearby, he was able to call through his watch. So it, it is a little George Jetsonist. I never thought I would do that. I, I know. And, I, and I'd like you to show people because I still in fact, when we when we uh, see each other in uh, in Texas, you're going to have to show me how you get your really cool setup with these. Uh, oh, yeah. That you make your own faces like yeah. I talked about that. that I have one for. When I'm driving, I have I built this one, and the cool thing is you can take different uh, what are they called? They're not called functions; they're called something else. But um, you can change these up on a on a blank face. Like I so when I'm driving, this is the one I have. It tells me my battery. This is my navigation over here. This is my I love Overcast. That's my favorite uh, app, and I also have the weather right there. But what I'll do is I'll you know I'll be listening to Overcast, and I can fast forward or whatever. And I, a lot of times I'll listen to kind of businessy podcasts. I can pause it. And then I go back to my face by just clicking that and I can actually, this is an app called just press record and I press that mm -hmm. and I can say, Hey, like I can go right here and go, Hey, Jim had a great idea on dealcasters.live. I need to go buy that new uh, portable generator he's talking about. And I do like that. And it also tr it transcodes it to my um, watch. And then I can go back and I can go back and turn on my podcast again and then also, you know, look at navigation. Cause a lot of times I have my navigation going on. I want to pull that back up because I like it when it taps you to turn left and turn right, so you don't you don't miss an exit sometimes. And I really like that about the Apple Maps. That's one of the reasons I use it. So yeah, that's just a really quick function. But um, there's so many cool things you can do with it. Like when we were at Disney not very long ago, we put our ticket to here, and I didn't have to do anything except just you know do the the Apple Pay where I could just go you know tink and go pay for stuff, or I could get in out of the park. When I was in London, this was my ticket on the subway. I just go Ding, like that. Wow. And so, yeah. Um, and, and you don't see many sales for, um, for Apple Watches. And there is one today. So it's a, a significant discount. So yep. go check yep. that out. Definitely. So, Bambi, thank you for following. I appreciate you following us over here on uh, Amazon Live. I appreciate that. If you're watching us on any other channels, make sure that you go to jeffc.live, click on follow, go to dealcasters.com live click on follow and uh check out these cool things we have so uh i kind of went again because i you were i was one to show off my watch so you can go oh, next no, that's, to no it's it's uh, yeah so uh, you know what we'll do is so we'll go with um i don't actually have this you have it but i want to talk about it in okay. the essence of it. so i'm going to go with the roadcaster pro mm. the roadcaster pro is on sale oh, and the is. reason i bring this up is uh i took it off know, and Chris and I talk about, I have the two. Right. But if you don't need the two yet, there's nothing wrong with the one. Now, let me show you. Uh, I'm going to do the, uh, I can do this at least with my overhead here. So you can kind of see, mm -hmm. um, you know, this is the Rodecaster Pro 2. So it, it's, a, it's a little bit more digital. Right. But I, I saw earlier today when you and Shannon were on that, you guys were talking about the fact that you could, uh, you know, you could do a lot of stuff with it in regards mm -hmm. to, uh, you know, same number of inputs in the back um, with what you have. 
you know, I've got the, all these sliders, I've got these smart pads. So you can still do these same things with the Rodecaster Pro, you know, I guess we'll call it one. But, you know, if you're not ready to spend what it costs for this, you know, Jeff's got the original. And, you know, so maybe you want to tell tell folks a little bit more about that, Jeff. Let's get, give you a chance yeah, to... Yeah, so what I did it. is I went to and I added it because I, I took it off. For the thing, I did not know it was on sale, so it's all the way at the end. So I'm going to highlight that and get that up there. So um, there, my thoughts are with the Rodecaster Pro, the first version. You know, I, I really I like new shiny things, and I really want it because Jim has it, and I don't uh, the two. But it, for right now, it's it's very functional for me. The difference between them, one is like you. You can really dial in your settings. Like for me, I have processing on my mic right now, and this is the Heil PR40, uh, which is a great mic. A lot of podcasters use it, but I have compression on, and it, it's pretty much you turn it on or turn it off. You turn your nose gate on, turn it off. With gyms, you're actually able to go and dial that in a little bit more. Um, go back and watch the stream that Shannon and I talked about it uh, right before this one if you're interested in it. Uh, Shannon really breaks it down because he has the two as the, the version two as well. So if you're just getting started and you have the budget, Get the uh, two if you're not and you're looking for some uh, budget deals. These are going to be on sale. This one's on sale right now. Um, it's it's you know it's pretty cheap um, for the first version. The thing that's going to be uh, you want to think about is I usually turn mine on and just forget about it. I messed with it a lot this week because we were testing mics. We had Heil Sound on that Jim and I did. We talked and tested mics and stuff. I, that's the first I've touched it in so long that I just don't I don't mess with it. If you're that kind of way and you know you don't need firmware updates, you don't need stuff like that, then go and get the two. But the 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 one, if you're a budget on a, a budget and you want to upgrade your sound card, you want to do some, have some effects and have some of this nice, rich kind of podcasty voice sound, then the one is is fine to use. So yeah, yeah, anyway. definitely. All righty. So you did the watch, you did the roadcaster. Those are all great finds. I I'm gonna do um, another deal of the day because I just talked about. Um, you know, sometimes it's better to, you know, get stuff on Prime Day because you'll never get it again. And that's this. This is the this is the Echo. And this is the version that has the high-end sound. Like, it's got all these tweeters in it, and it's all facing towards you. And it sounds pretty amazing. I, I use my um, mind for mostly control of uh, my house. Like, I turn on my alarm. I turn on my lights. I turn on all sorts of things. But it's the... This is the fourth generation Echo, and it's a super, and I hadn't upgraded. I had some of the old hockey pucks, not even mm -hmm. with the fabric on them, and this is a huge upgrade, and I really like the sound of this. You can actually buy two and have them in stereo, which I have not tried yet. Weird thing uh, is, is like even when you get the black one, it comes with a white cord, and a lot of people comment about that, but if that doesn't bother you, you want to upgrade, um, these are like, I think, um, almost half off right now, and it's a prime day deal. Uh, so once again, you only have a certain amount of time to get this, but I use it to control my lights. We actually have outdoor lights that we have set up to be controlled with it. I set my alarm with it. We, you know, I set a lot of timers with it because I do a lot of the cooking. And so um, we have multiple ones of these and I can drop in on my wife. That sounded weird. I can, it's called <laughs> drop in in the app. You can actually, it's like an intercom. So we can talk back and forth. My office is in like my back pasture. And so we can talk back and forth, and she's, hey, you know, come on in, the show's on, or whatever. And so these are really, really cool. Do you have you have these in your house too, right, Jim? I have I have the hockey pucks. Yeah, and I've actually got um, the shows, which, which oh, we'll that's about. right, yeah, and yeah. I, and I did fix I did fix the uh, problem I had yesterday, so we'll have we'll have some fun with that. Oh yeah, a, yeah. Let me go switch to your camera then, so that's uh, that'll be good. So okay. You can show yes, this because I the the Echo and the Alexa ecosystem I think is a really they they're better than Apple. I mean, I, Siri's yeah. kind of stupid. Uh, so this is yeah. So this is the Echo Show Eight, and I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. And so one of the other things, and I, I probably should change it in the carousel since I'm talking about it. So this is a uh, 42% off it's for the second yeah, generation. That's a great one. There, there's a 10 inch one. There's, I think they came out with a 15 inch one mm -hmm. and you can do video calls on this. So I got one for my parents. I finally got it to them, but now it's a matter of getting them to figure out the technology. So that'll be a whole <laughs> other story. Right. But I have this attached to uh, 
my A device or, you know, app. And so I've got it tied in with my Blink cameras. And so what I'm going to do now is, is I'm going to okay. ask, I'm going to say, Alexa, show me the front door camera. And so oh, you're now cool. yeah. live here in a second as it warms up. That is, and see, it actually has an infrared light that oh. um, the Blink camera. So you can, I can see my front door. I can actually talk to people through it. And mm -hmm. I did have to do that once where I was in the middle of doing a production and a guy knocked at the door and I had to say, you know, hey, I'll be up there in a couple minutes. Kind of probably oh. freaked him out because it wasn't the doorbell. It was the actual, the camera. And then I'll just say, Alexa, stop. And then I'll say, uh, Alexa, show me the carport camera. So you can have multiple cameras. Now, and Blinks are Amazon's version, right? Aren't yes. they? Okay. Yes. Look at that. That is really slick. And this is a deal of the day, too, I'm pretty sure, that's going yep. on right and now. So, and so there's a, looks like a spider or something's on the camera. <laughs> so I'm not seeing it. But yep. that's our carport. And, that uh, is really cool. You can even see there's some moss flying around. Is that your uh, new? Uh, is that your new uh, car? Uh, to the left, yes. Ah, that's okay. the Cadillac, and then the, yeah. the hybrid is over there to the left. Too bad they don't sell those on Amazon. <laughs> that, would be nice. that would be uh, slick, wouldn't it? Yeah. Alexa, stop. And then, and then we talked about this too. Um, we did this yesterday. I'll, I'll kind of do it quickly, but we won't go through the whole thing. Oh, right now I, I confused. Alexa, stop. Alexa, play the terminal list on Prime Video. Oh, yeah. I still got to watch that. And so as you can see, it'll actually play video on here. And, and, and you know, and then if you can connect this to the speakers that you were talking about, mm -hmm. right? So it's ready to play it. But I'm going to stop because it's, you know, 18 plus. Alexa, stop. And uh, this is with Chris Pratt. And then yeah. Alexa, stop. <laughs> yeah. So the, the funny thing, so this is why I looked at these Echoes too, because of the screen on them. And they have a really, almost like a, um, it's, it's, I think, is it the, is it the show 10 or something? It looks like a, yeah. almost like a, a, a screen that's like, I mean, like a picture frame. And I was like, right. that is really, really cool. And because Amazon bought the rights to, Thursday night football, these yes. are a little, I mean, you know, you could have one of these on your desk in your office or, or wherever that you can like, cause I'm thinking like, cause I do a lot of cooking, like it should be nice to have one right there where I oh, don't yeah. miss a play, you know, when it's, when stuff's going <laughs> well, on. And, so. and you know, it's funny, Chris, Chris and I, uh, when, when uh, I first got this, it came with the, uh, I think it's like the cooking mm -hmm. network for right. a year for free. And, right. and we kept joking, like, Oh, look, we get the cook. You know, right, they, right. You know learn, learn how to cook, which I haven't. But that's what some people use it for because you can right. stick it on there, you know, get your recipes, everything else. And then, um, but yeah, so they, they're on a deep discount uh, as well as those Blink cameras. The Blink right. cameras are 50% off for a set of three. So um, that's a good and, deal. And the batteries, if you use them properly, meaning you don't like have stuff moving in front of the camera all the time will last mm -hmm. from one to two years and and they're out wow. you know they're so you can just replace the batteries and it'll tell you hey it's time to replace the batteries and you don't and, have uh, to and so you don't have to run wires to them you can just no have them wires wherever you want. at all okay it, that's it really cool runs off of wi-fi and so i get notifications you know of course i have to kind of decide how mm -hmm. i want the notifications or my phone will go crazy all the time but I, but you know, it saves the recording as well. So if you had some sort of issue, okay, I got the recording. I can kind of prove, you know, whatever mm -hmm. might have gone wrong. Um, so I, I find it to be a great, uh, great thing. And then I've actually, I'll, I'll, I'll wait to tell you about more of the other stuff I have. But that, but that's what I like about the show. And and not only can you check your blank cameras from that, you can also do it with your Fire Stick. Mm, that's really and cool so you can be watching yeah, on TV your tv yeah and you just talk to your uh your remote and say you know show, and and so now you get to see it on your whole you know tv right. screen right so it's really it's really convenient you know then you have to get and and because you can talk through it right i don't have to go to the door i can just mm -hmm. talk through the camera mm -hmm. and it's like you know, just leave it on the porch and leave right <laughs> 
So I want to give a shout out to uh, Laura Williams. I told her because her name came up, said, hello, James. And she says, oh, I share that with my husband. But a big shout out to Laura Williams. Thank you for coming in here and following us. I uh, appreciate you watching the show. So um, I have highlighted right now in my carousel is I'm talking on the Heil PR40, which I mentioned I really, really love. Um, I'm going to go full screen here so you can see it. I've actually got their shock mount on there. Uh, this is their gold and black one. Um, but uh, on that note, and um, I wanted to talk about, and I know you wanted to have it too, I, and we're talking about deals today, like the stuff we found that are on sale. This isn't on sale, but I wanted to mention it because I'm talking into it. But the Sure um, M7 is out right now, and it's got, um, it's significantly, it's a Prime Day deal. It's significantly discounted. Um, this is what it looks like. I'm going to go to my other camera. Um, and Jim, you can talk about this because this is the yeah, mic you're I'm using right talk, now. I'm actually talking into it right now. Yeah, that's so right. I'm going to pull you up here um, right there. But the the one I have highlighted in my carousel, I got cords going everywhere. So um, I shouldn't have actually had it plugged in because I don't need it to be right now unless we do a demo. But this one came with the the microphone. It comes with the the um, kind of the mount, the bracket yep. that holds it on. But it also comes with this very cool, uh, I think it's a Manfrotto Pixie um, a little tripod that you can sit on your desk and it just holds it there. So a lot of times when you're, um, you know, you're getting started, you need, you don't need to have a boom mic or anything like we have. You want to move this around. So it comes with this. It's a great kit. Um, and these things sound amazing. And the other cool thing, and we talked about this a lot yesterday and Shannon and I talked about it today again as well, is it gives you the option. Like if you're getting started podcasting and you don't have a road uh, caster pro or pro two, like we talked about, this allows you to plug in via USB. And then when you get a Rodecaster, you can upgrade very, very easily. And you have the XLR, which gives you, you know, you can put it in there and do some more controls on it. I mean, the Sure app that comes with the USB thing where you can control these top uh, buttons where your gain is, you can mute the mic and all that kind of stuff and change the, where you know, if you monitor it with a headphone, there's a headphone monitor there in the back. That's where you plug in the USB. Um, so you can do all that stuff just with the USB when you're just wanting to plug into your computer. But when you want to upgrade, I mean, this is, this is, it kind of scratches all the itches in all the places, I guess, is what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. I'm and they also have, they also have an app that you can uh, put on your desktop when you're using, I think the USB part that lets right. you do some things as well yeah. for changing your, your sound. Um, you know, but I think going back to what you talked about and Michelle talked about yesterday was, you know, sometimes you're going to find the microphone that, you know, makes your voice sound the way you want it to. And I thought it was really funny when you and Shannon were on earlier, right? And because because we were having issues with the comments, but that was me that said, preach it. Oh, you know, yeah, you have yeah. like, it's a microphone and they don't know how to use it. And they think that the microphone Is doesn't it work. Yeah. Yeah. And it's, you know, a lot of times if you're going USB, if you're not using any sort of software, uh, you know, that, that's, that was one of the reasons why I got an interface to begin right. with is because I did have times where I felt like the computer was deciding, oh, I'm going to switch back to the microphone that's built into the computer instead of recognizing the USB microphone that mm -hmm. you plug in. And I've, I've found that even sometimes, I think, with uh, headphones. I don't know if you've run into that sometimes, Jeff. Um, you know, because sometimes these computers have a mind of their own. Uh, right. Right. Not saying it's the Terminator, but uh, but you never know. <laughs> right. The mind of its own. Yeah, I get that. So uh, let me go back to this. And um, thank you guys for joining us over and watching. Um, and we got some really cool deals, deals we found. But both Jim and I like, I mean, I like the high PR 40 which I'm talking to. Don't get me wrong. Mm -hmm. But the deal and like if you're starting out with podcasting, this sure, um, you know, M MV7 is just a really great deal right now. And the ability that you can have to upgrade, I just, it's just kind of a no-brainer. In fact, when I first started, I got the the Yeti Mic uh, Pro, which was the same thing. It's like I started and I just plugged it into my computer. It was a USB, but then I got a, a soundboard and I was able to use my XLR connection with that. And Shannon and I talked about this a long time. Is like, you can upgrade your cameras and stuff, but once you find a mic, they don't, you know, the technology isn't really, you know, you're not having it change every year. And so finding right. a mic that works and looks and that you have ability to upgrade, I think is really, really important. So. Yeah, yeah, it, de it definitely is, you know, and I think for me, the last thing that I have upgraded was my camera. 
Yeah. And I just did that in September when I got the, uh, I don't even know if you can buy them. That's why I didn't put it in the carousel, the Sony ZV-E10. Yeah, they're hard to find. Um, I, yeah. I didn't go to the the next level up, but this does everything I needed to do. I can, you know, you know, walk around. I've got some other tools that I've got uh, got in the carousel that I haven't actually used with it yet. That's like one of those things I got to do in my spare time. Mm -hmm. uh, but, uh, but yeah, I think the microphones are important. And, and in fact, speaking of microphones, since we're talking about Shure, uh -huh. I'm going to do, do a little swing in here. Okay, I'm going to go full screen on you. Oh, I did it the wrong person. There we go. And so can you hear me now? Oh, look at that. Yeah. So this is the Shure Super 55. This is this is like, we, we like to call it the Chad mic, right? Yeah, this that's is, right, Chad Peterson. Yeah, yeah Peterson mic. You know, he likes to wear his hat and pretend like he's Frank Sinatra or crooner right. back in the day. Yeah. But this is 45% off for Prime Day. Mm. Um, I don't know if the special may continue after that, but if this is this is a solid mic, if you you know you like the, the kind of that different look, and that was what was kind of cool too with some of the mics that we talked about from Heil yesterday that mm -hmm. were actually used in the Hunger Games. Yeah, the fin and uh, the fins, and uh, those are really cool. So I mean, it's it's kind of nice to have have a different look, and so. Um, well, this, and there's a lot, you know the rise, and you guys have done it too. Dealcasters Live is the the video podcasting. And so having a mic that stands out over everybody else's sometimes may be the look that you're wanting. And so these type of mics that have that retro look, if it fits your brand and they sound great, then, you know, why not? Yeah. So. And I don't, and I don't know if you have it in your carousel, but what I'm using with this, and I think you are as well, uh, while we're on the subject. Mm. Oh is, yeah. Yeah. Is the, um, is the boom arm is the Heil, is it the PL2? Yeah, the PL2T. 2T. Yep. Mm -hmm. And I and Jeff are both in love with this boom arm. It is amazing. And these uh, are on sale right now. And, they, yeah. you know, Heil never usually has things on sale. And this is a, and this is the most solid arm I've ever used, ever. Yep. Yeah, I, yeah. for, for me as well, you know, um, we, we, we know that we had to get you some WD-40 for the one that you're That's using. still on there. I haven't changed it over yet. It's it's yep. still This is the fin, and it's still... But you it just holds it in place, and there's no noise, which is a big deal. Right. You can mount... And Michelle was saying you can mount cameras on those. You can see gyms in there. It's not moving at all, and it's just... And there, yeah, and there's different adapters. I mean, I don't have it because of this mic specifically, but uh, what did I do with it? And you're using it. Yeah, I have it on the side here. Yeah. You've got the shock mount, right? Mm -hmm. This shock mount is another right. really good piece of gear. It's it's not on sale, um, unfortunately. But it is a, it but, is a nice uh, piece of gear. A good, great accessory to get for your boom arm, especially if you're using some of the other mics uh, that Heil makes. And mm -hmm. uh, well, it probably would even work with the Shure mic as well, because it part we you know I, I learned yesterday, right? It's the XLR cables what goes through there, yeah. so it's not like trying to fit that. But uh, but it's a really cool look too, and um, and, and it even does like make this, a difference. yeah, this one right, you'll notice compared to the Shure uh, MV7, there's no pop filter on here. Mm -hmm. It's built right? in, yeah. It's built yeah. in, and that's uh, that sometimes is something that it, that people have to get used to. Now, I guess if you were out, like I don't know why you would use it outside, but if you're using this outside, that maybe could be a little bit of an issue. Mm -hmm. Uh, so I've seen a lot of, uh, there's some YouTube videos and I like to listen to some, some blues and some harmonica players. And I, they use mics like they, they actually had a, a shootout between the fin and that one and how it sounded with, uh, uh, with a harmonica and it sounded cool cause they're up there and they got the, you know, it looks like a blues microphone. It looks like what Elvis used and all that right. stuff. So that's very, very right. cool. Yeah. Um, and and it, like we've talked about either getting, uh, getting something where you hang the mic down Mm -hmm. or you could get a stand and have it come up. So if you wanted to have it at a different angle, but based on the way I have this set up right now, right, I've got it more doing. The and it sounds down. great. It sounds great. So, yeah. Well, that's, yeah. that's really cool. So, uh, yeah. So, so now it's your turn. All right. Mr. So I am going yeah. to continue. Um, one, this, and I've talked about this a little bit, and this is also uh, continues to be on sale. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and I put it up when, when Shannon was here. Um, but this is the Shure uh, MV88 Plus video kit. And I talked a lot about um, 
you know, traveling. Like I wanted to, you know, sometimes we have to do live shows and I know Jim does live shows as well. And the thing about this is this allows me to travel and c get good audio. Now the mics we've talked about before, all the ones that we are speaking into are dynamic mics. They don't need to have power. My fin has to have power because it has lights. But other than that, it would still work even if I didn't put phantom power to it. This is a condenser mic. And it comes in this really, really cool kit. Once again, I really like these Manfrotto um, Pixie tripods where it has the ball head that you, it just locks it into place and they don't, it doesn't drift on you, which is like some of them. They're just, yep. they're really solid. And so you have those different angles. So I really like these. So I'm going to put it together for you guys, but it comes in this nice little um, kit and you just unroll it and you have everything you need. So uh, what goes on top, this is for your iPhone. This is an iPhone clip. And it just attaches right here, and it's got a cold shoe at the top. Um, and so you just put your your phone in here, and so then Scott the, Ayers wants to know if you can say ball head on Amazon Live. <laughs> so Scott Ayers said that. Yeah. Jeez. Isn't he doing live shows? What's he doing over here? So no. you you um, you put on top. You put the this little microphone clamp just like this, and, uh, and then you put the microphone on, and, and you can see it tells you left and right. And the cool thing is you can have it in selfie mode or you can have it like if you're out there walking around and you're shooting something, you're at a conference and you're doing interviews or whatever. So I'm going to put it in selfie mode just like this. And then it comes with both cables here for like it has the USB-C, which will go to, you know, an Android phone or it came, comes with a lightning cable and you can just plug it in right here in the back. And it's got a spot also to monitor the audio right there. You see, you can plug right. it in your headphones right there and so you can have that and the cool the app is amazing there's two apps that come with it there's a i think it's called movie i can't remember but there are sure apps but it lets you control the sound um like you can yeah, go I think it's called the sure motive app motive that's it and yeah. you can control how tight you want the signal you can control how wide it is you can actually this windscreen comes off and if you see there are actually three places the mic picks up there's a mic here and there's a mic here on the side and a mic on the other side for the stereo and I can actually set it like this. Let's say Jim and I were in a room and we could have him on one side and I'm on the other one and we could do a podcast show and just have those two mics on so you don't have that drift and it would pick up left and right, each of us. And you can, all the stuff in the app, you can have compression, you can have limiters, all sorts of things. But this is amazing because you can pack it up and you can go run and gun with it, looking at your phone uh, in there, seeing yourself if you're doing selfie modes, you can have it the other way if you're, you know, you're doing... Things, but I just love how compact this is. The other thing, we're going live on on shows or if you want to do a Zoom call or something, this actually can plug into your computer. Right. That's right. what, and it sounds really, really good. If you go to yeah, you, you actually did that, right? I haven't tried that yet. You you yeah. used it on the computer? Yeah, it, it sounds really good. And the other thing is, is like I did some demos if on Jeffsy uh, in my you scroll through and see the the product video I do with that. There's some tests that I, I did with it um, just out and about. And so you can look at that. But it sounds, I mean, shockingly good. Because I had been carrying a, like a lapel mic that I would run. And, uh, you know, it gets in my beard and makes noise. And this, I can set a, a right over here and talk. You won't see it in the camera. And it picks up really, really mm -hmm. tight uh, feel. I can narrow it down. And it just sounds really, really great. So... That's my yeah. find because it, it's and it is a um, it's like normally two forty nine and it's dropped down to one seventy four, so I mean it's right. a great deal right now. I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go a little bit I'm gonna go a little bit crazy. Uh oh, my, what are you gonna do? Gonna, might as well get this one out of the way because it's heavy. That's what uh -oh. I'm doing. <laughs> um, so this this is um, you know I've run into a lot of issues with storms. Oh, I have uh, to. Here. And so. I was lucky enough that the people from Eco. Forum, oh my gosh! I gotta go to you. You're gonna don't get a hernia. <laughs> um, I got this. Uh, I've got this. Is the Delta Max, and so this thing is on sale. Is it all battery? Is that all it is? It's not a gas, is it? No, it's all battery. So you can use this oh. inside. Look at she got six plugs here, and then. Actually, let me let me zoom out. I think this is this is one time where the camo app comes in handy. Um, but still, that's a that's a and beast. You, and you can use that's the cool you, thing you can use it inside and not kill yourself. 
Yeah, you can also, it, it's got, you can use solar panels. Uh, it comes with, you could charge this up in your car with the, the car charger. Um, and then on the other side here. Now, how long does it take to charge that all the way up? Does it it take did like, not take long at all. In fact, really? I bet you, I'm going to turn it on for a second just to show you how, how much charge it's holding. I charged this probably over two months ago. And it's still at 100%. And it's still at, yeah, basically 100%. And you can see you've got USB-A, you've got USB-C. Mm -hmm. um, th and this will actually, um, you know, according to the information, so you could charge you could charge a laptop 32 times. You could run a 60-watt mini fridge for 33 to 66 hours. Wow. Coffee maker for 1.9 hours, you know, uh, air, even an air conditioner for one to two hours, that's 1,800 watts, mm -hmm. uh, even a space heater. And that's the problem you run into sometimes with um, some of these portable, if you want to call it chargers, mm -hmm. is that that they don't let you do that. Now, it's definitely heavy not duty. Light. Yeah, it's not a light thing. Not Which, light a lot of people could take, the, I've seen a lot of people take this camping, like they'll have it. Yeah. Uh, so they can charge their phones or they want to watch TV or something, yep. which why you go camping yeah, and, and watch TV. Fact, I don't that's know. that's kind of my, my next, uh, I think my next plan is, is, is exactly to your point. Cause I've done that in the past during football season. We'll, we would go outside and then I'm having to run a long extension cord oh. for the TV. Now I can just plug everything into that. And so I'm, I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to that. So yeah, but th it's actually a prime day deal. Um, you know, it's that time of year, you know, in the mm -hmm. East, it's uh, called hurricane season. And, um, and trust me, we've had our power go out even here in, you know, yeah. in the area where I live enough that, you know, it's nice to have something that, you know, cause, and I, I don't know that they were on sale. The other thing I've done, I don't know about you, Jeff, I have some uh, surge, uh, not only protectors, mm -hmm. but they have battery backup. Yeah, and then I've got them on have, my, my internet plugged in so even if my power goes out like this stuff will keep running for a little bit you know because uh yeah you just never know and the thing is those are because you know you can, i'm all, i have a generator because if somebody sneezes hard here we lose power <laughs> it's the way it feels um and the thing is is being able to have the generator far enough away from the house always makes you nervous because you know people die yep. every year from carbon yep. monoxide stuff yep. this you could have so you could actually have your generator running and not have a huge load on it and then have it in and turn it on your tv with something like this and watch some yes. or download some things from netflix or whatever so that's that is really cool and i'm really jealous that you have one and i don't so, yep yeah um, oh yeah definitely high quality um you know it's uh one of my most cherished possessions that uh <laughs> that is right. about being an amazon uh in so <laughs> yes that's he has a. Uh, um, he's like, would this fit and hold the blue snowball? Uh, EcoFlow is so, oh, he's probably talking about with your thing. Uh, he oh, said yeah. EcoFlow is off. He has one of their smaller ones. Mm. And, uh, yeah. But yeah and, and well, he's now, in and Texas and we could lose power at any time with our power. Now that I got my, my hybrid, I can take this. And so if my wife and I want to go camping, right, we oh, can yeah. put this in the back and power Run some a mini Yeah, you'd have your cold beverages right there. That'd be kind of nice. Yep. Um, so this is really cool. So this is once again, uh, these are, I, I scoured the, uh, the website and we're finding stuff for you guys. And I actually found this yesterday because, so I'm using these, like, they're like $15 They're me, uh, things. I have those in my, on my carousel, which are great. They've been, I've had these for years. I have multiple pairs because I run over them with my chair and all the stuff, but I wanted to upgrade cause I, I've been talking to, um, uh, uh, Jim over there. And one of the things is that I got it and I bought it yesterday on prime day and it came today. That, that just blows my oh, mind wow. that there's two days of prime day. And if you order something on the first day, you can get, uh, like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it just, blew my, so this, this is an unboxing folks right here, uh, live. This is the sure, uh, two fifteens. And I've really wanted to kind of upgrade them and they're the same kind of thing. So they go around your ear, um, and so I'm just going to open these up because I, they came like right after Shannon and I went live. And so I wanted to see them. And you have something similar. You have the, the granddaddy yeah, of to, these. I have the, the next ones. I, uh, I think they're right. kind of the next level up. Yeah. Yeah. So one of the cool things is they come with multiple tips. So yeah. I'm going to 
pop both of us up here. Um, that's always nice. They didn't used to do that, and there looks like there's even a tool there to help you get it on and off. So um, even more tips. There's a little carrying case right here, which mm -hmm. is nice. So instructions that I'm sure I won't ever read. You'll read them eventually if you yes, really need if to. if I need it. And then, oh, there's even more tips in the in the top there. So yeah. that's very cool. And then uh, the actual headphones which are and you got and you got the wired ones. Yes, I because I always want to do wired when I do live shows. I don't like, yep. I don't trust the Wi-Fi. So and I like the clear ones because like most times people can't even tell you have them in. Right. So very easy to get out. And so and I don't like to show people my head ones that I'm wearing because you never know what's going to come <laughs> out of your. But those are those are the tips right there, and they go around and they. This is a a bendable thing, so you can go behind your ear. Yep. It's like that. Oh, there's a, and they pivot too, which yes. is nice. My other ones do not do that. I think these, yeah, it comes right out. Yeah, so you could. Yep. So, yeah, kind of like break, break away so you don't. Uh, that is nice. Yourself. Yank your, your head off. So yep. those are the uh, the sure. The, the, only, the only thing I had to do, SC and I think it's my live wire, I got a an extension cord. I have I, one. Yeah. That way I have more room to, to move around. And to be yeah. honest, Amazon Basics has a great extension cord. That's what I get for my, when I have, uh, like, I need an extension. Amazon Basics has those cords that you can extend that. Because you're right, you don't want to be tied to the, the Roadcaster is over there and it'll be too too tight. But, yeah, these are, on these are like, on sale. They're featured now. Uh, it's a Prime Day deal. So I was stoked that these came today after I got them yesterday. But, once again, this is the last day, folks, for Prime Day. So if you're wanting to upgrade some of your equipment, like me, this is a perfect excuse to uh, to do it. So put it in your cart and <laughs> enjoy it. So it sure has had a ton of deals. They're still going on. Um, so, like, you know, yeah. we, we've talked about it. Make sure that you go over there and, and look. So, anyway. Yeah, sp speaking of, uh, of, of, as you like to call it, sure deals. Um, <laughs> there you go. You're in the spirit I, I'm of it now. The, I've got the, uh, the, the, the Aeonic Freeze. Oh, yeah. These are... Um, you know, I think this is almost half price, 40, 40, 45 percent off. Mm -hmm. So this makes this cheaper than the AirPods. And you were talking about these earlier today. And so if folks can see, right, this You're is Bluetooth. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. And this has 21 hours of life. And you can see it's already looking to connect because I, I do use it with a, a computer upstairs. And so I just stick it in my ear and... Uh, you know, I, and you can use just one ear if you wanted yeah. to, right? You don't have no, to. Tell use them what both. you did when you you were doing a recording. That was really. Oh yeah. So yeah. so what I what ended up happening when I was at Social Media Week Lima, I was doing a live stream, and I was having audio issues with my setup for whatever reason. It wasn't wanting to cooperate, so I gave one of these to my guest that was sitting next to me, and Tim, who was in another place, my co-host. He was at his house, and so we could both hear him, and you can actually talk through these. Mm. So this ended up being um, also the microphone for uh, for us to be able to talk, and he could hear us just fine. So that was uh, that was kind of neat, you know. Plus, because it's not necessarily, I would say, and I think you would agree, it's it, they're not completely no complete noise canceling i want to they're, say i think they're noise they call them noise isolation because yeah, i think yeah. it fills your ear yeah. and keeps sound from coming in right and so uh that way it it kept you know a lot of the noise of the room because you know you were there too that place had a little bit right. of uh right noise acoustic wise nobody could tell that there were a bunch of other people you know within so many feet so it's almost like having a great mic like this but uh but yeah so that was that was kind of a nice uh fallback plan so these are these are really solid um mm -hmm. i will say though you and i both talked about this because they're not wrapped around your ear right it's like i do get that fear of oh it, it could fall out of my ear it's your coffee so, yeah. um, this isn't something i would probably work out with mm. um i've got some others I'll, i'm going to show later that might be better for working out um you know e even technically with the 215s that are wireless, mm -hmm. you could work out. But I still think it, to me, I don't know. I just don't feel like these are yeah. meant for for sweating. Even though I think, um, 
you know, when they, when you look at, uh, well, actually, yeah, actually, when you look at the photos on the, on the shore website, they're not showing anybody doing exercise with these. It's more just people listening in different, uh, and they're, different... they're really high quality and they have a, just like the AirPods, they have that pass through, like you can tap on them so you can hear your environment. If somebody comes up to you to talk it, it kind of has a microphone that picks up the stuff. So that's really handy. Uh, and so, yeah, shout out to sure for, so I got some too. Uh, and I, the case is a little bigger if you're used to AirPods, but I think these last, how many hours outside yeah, of the 20, case? 20, 21 hour battery life. And I think, uh, you get like three see. charges with the case, putting it in before you have to charge the case up, I believe, because you charge the case here at the bottom. So, right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Two. Uh, oh yeah. It's, so it's 21 hours, including the case. So it's okay. two charges and, uh, and, and you know with the with the case and so yeah so you got uh they charge up pretty quick if mm -hmm. uh if you need it so you know so that's the other thing if you needed to you could alternate between ears and get even more time out of it if you don't want to have uh right both ears in so i yeah i've really been happy with these um i i i kind of alternate between these and the aionic 40s which are you know over the ear over the ear yeah. um yeah. you know because that was one thing kind of like you i used to you know, even when I first started doing Amazon, I was using over the ear monitors, but <clears throat> wanted to go to the cleaner look. And so mm -hmm. Chris was the one that took the, the plunge first because he's the, uh, the audio file of our group. Yeah. And so the sure, um, th they, they, you know, they make mics and we've been talking about a couple of their mics already and really great, but they just fit right in this case and they're, they're, they, you know, a lot of people say, oh, they look too big, but they don't, they don't look big and they don't feel big. You can see the little contacts there at the bottom is where they charge. And then right. there's buttons on the top and, you know, it's, it's trying to pair right now, like Jim was saying, but they, the case, I like the case. I like the size actually, because I feel sometimes like I lose my AirPods case. So, mm -hmm. um, but these are significantly deep discounted for today. It's a prime day deal and make sure you guys uh, go check those out if you're interested in some new Airbuds, and you know, maybe you don't want the apples. And I did because, and I have it in my carousel as well. But I do have the uh, AirPods Pro because if you like earbuds, you know, there's a something you need to check out too, especially because they have that dynamic sound. And uh, and I'm so jealous. Uh, Shannon had the big uh, AirPods Pro Max over ear headphones. I really like those because I like to listen with my AirPods to movies. That's what I. Because of the why they have that special thing, the dynamic sound you can turn on, right. and it's just freaky. It's so good that the, they can come out of these little earbuds, and the Max has those too. So, yeah. So those are uh, two two options. Those are both the Sure is significantly discounted. Apple, you know, doesn't like to discount a lot, but they are discounted today. If you are have your mind set on the AirPods Pro, so I wanted to make sure you guys knew about that as well, because we the whole goal of this was trying to, uh, you know, uh, get you guys some deals. Let me make sure I didn't. I want to go back a little bit um, to some lighting stuff because yeah. this is on sale right now is the, the um, I'm going to try this again. We'll see if this hat works, but um, I'm going to go put those in there. And right now they have a sale. We'll go to this right here. There we go. So those are my key lights uh, on and I'm able to control them with my, uh, you can see my Spider-Man poster. Yay, Spider-Man. Um, <laughs> that... You, I have them on both sides, and you can actually, I can control them and turn them off by my desktop because they're wireless, turn them back on. I can change, you know, the brightness if I want, turn them back down. The, 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 these are the Key Lights Pro, and um, they have what's on sale right now is they're called their Key Light Air. And the ones I have clamp on the table, and that may be an option that you want, but you may want to um, look at these because they're significantly cheaper right now with the sale. And it has the base. So if you have room on your desk and you want to have one or two, like I have over here, I have another one. My office is a mess because I'm unboxing a bunch of stuff. Uh, but, yeah, so you can have two on each side. You can control the lighting. So I really like these a lot. But they are on sale um, as well. And then Jim made me aware today of the actual um, – I think I hit something. Let's see if I can get it back. Go back to here. Um, you mentioned today, Jim, uh, the, why is my camera not working all of a sudden? And these are on sale right now as well. 
the and I was controlling that light. It's awful bright now. I need to turn it down. Um, with these stream decks, so I started out. I actually got this on Prime Day. Is the smaller one uh, a couple years ago, and this is how I control my shows. And when you see me pulling up stuff and these lower thirds and everything switching, the camera switching, and my lights, I'm controlling it with a stream deck. And you can actually change it for different shows you're on. This is the small 15 button one. They have Mark II is out, and so that's what's in the carousel, their newest version. And this gets actually can be taken off. I've actually seen people, you know, build it into a custom desk, so you can have it flat, or you can have it on, you know, a uh, this little stand that it comes with, and that's a really cool option uh, as well. And then I also have, and both of these are discounted today in Prime, uh, the 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 big mama, which is the uh, Stream Dex XL, and uh, I just knocked it off. But this is how I'm controlling most of the things, and I can switch it for different shows. But if you have any I, any one, any uh, desire to actually do a live show, then this is kind of invaluable to to have. And a lot of video editors use it because you can all this stuff is programmable. If you look, you can actually see I can you can see Jim out there at the top because it actually grabs the camera because I'm using eCam. Uh, and Ecamm integrates right with this. Same with the, all the big streamers, OBS, uh, uh, Stream Labs. There's all integrations with this, but you can con- customize this any way you want. But this is on sale, and if you're a, a live streamer, this is the day to pick it up. So, and and yep. you use one too, right, Jim? I do. I, I you know now you made me think I might have to get a second one, but you know, <laughs> well, because yeah, the thing is, you don't have to because. You can actually program the buttons at the bottom to actually go to another screen. So you could have multiple right. screens. I just, I like every, everything laid out because I have a lot of stuff going on in this show, not so much as some of the other ones. And having those all at once where I have them laid out in a kind of a grid pattern where I can kind of understand thing. That's why I, I really like um, this big one because you right. have a little bit more options. And the cool, it's kind of cool too. You can actually put your logo in here and like when you turn off your computer, it has my logo in the buttons, which is oh, kind of wow. fun. So nerdy stuff like that that you can do. You can, you can have sound effects. Anything you can assign to your computer, you can do it with the with the Stream Deck. So it's totally worth it. And uh, it's, uh, yeah. this I A lot of people get these when we talk about them in our live shows because they, they see right. the value in them. So watch. I'll switch back to Jim and me. Nice. So. So I'm going to go with something that uh, we talked about earlier today during your show. Mm-hmm. This is the uh, Logitech Stream Cam. Oh, yeah, Logitech. And so I was using, this was my next uh, webcam after the C920. And the reason I went with it, and it's on a, it's on a very nice discount. Uh, it is a USB-C uh, connection. Right. So that's something that you have to be aware of. I, did, I think I was able to use an adapter before, but it also comes with a tripod mount. So if you want to put on a tripod and you have a cord, so it doesn't have to go on top of your computer, but it can also sit on top of your computer. Mm-hmm. Now, what it does is, as you can see right now, it's horizontal, but you can actually take this out and make it vertical. That's cool. And so if you wanted to create vertical video through your desktop for whatever you're doing, now you don't have to sit there and worry about, oh, you know, because I, I know a lot of times people are trying to turn horizontal videos into vertical mm-hmm. videos. And it just doesn't quite work. Right. So you can do this. And then I want to say it's the Logi software that comes with it will let you do um, a, a lot. Yeah, Johnny, I, I was able to get an adapter that goes USB-C to A. And it did work. So that is definitely something you can do. I was using it on an older um, uh, iMac Mm. before I uh, switched over to the Mac Mini. And now I'm actually using this on my, uh, I have a, believe it or not, I have a PC. I I haven't really used it a lot, but I bought it because I was going to try to learn how to use uh, vMix, but that hasn't Mm. happened yet. (laughs) Um, But this is, this is a really, uh, really solid. I, I, the price is great. I mean, right now it's not much more than what I would say it would cost you for a brand new C920. And I, I think it's got a great camera. And, and uh, you know, like I said, the features you get with the Logie software is really good as well. Um, and it does, it actually has a, like a little bit of a light that'll come on when you uh, do it so that you know that it's on. Oh, it's but, got a, yeah. an idiot light. That's I think what they call them. Yeah. Hey, you're, yeah. Idiot, you're on, on your own on live. <laughs> yeah. So very yeah. cool. 
So oh, I, and so Gabe's got a question. Maybe uh -huh. you got an answer for him. He wants to know: Would you recommend the Brio or the Elgato face cam? So Eric Fisher used the Elgato face cam for a while, and he liked it. Um, one of the things that I would say, because that camera that I was showing the key lights with is actually a Brio, and I used to use that all the time for all my live streams until I upgraded to. Uh, I don't know if I have this on the uh, the carousel or not, but it's the uh, Canon M50 is what I use. And so um, I don't think I have it, but um, the, it's fine to use. Either one of those I think would work for you. Uh, there have been some issues with stock. So if you find one, like if Jim's is in stock right now, I would probably get that one because, you know, they're both 4K cameras, I believe, and you can't really go wrong. They're both good companies. And uh, I would snag one now because uh, you know, for a while there, you could not find a camera and there was those black market right. deals that you had to use. That, and so. that's, why, that's why mine is, is white because when I had to uh -huh, order yeah. it direct from Logie and the black ones weren't available, I said, well, nobody's going to see my camera, so I'll get the white. The, I think the Brio's on sale today too. I, I'm not 100%, but I know Logitech had a bunch of stuff uh, on Prime. So I would do, you know, in Amazon, you can actually go up there and, and click on uh, and select just Prime Day stuff and search that way. But you could do that and see if uh you know what it is but either one of those work jim's is a great camera but yeah um those those are awesome so the the main thing is to do you know to keep just keep on going live Let me go back i hit i hit the wrong button there let's see so oh we're gonna let's because i'm a, a headphone nerd and these are on um i have they're the deal of the day and uh, i want to talk about them is you know we talked about so sound cancellation headphones and mm -hmm. i've got a couple of them here that i really really like and i'm a kind of a bose fan and so the first one is the uh quiet comfort 35s and i've had these for i did a video for them the other day uh, over four years and i've had to replace uh the ear pads but they're just super solid they're the most comfortable headphones that i own this is what i want to when i want to chill listen to music i edit like guys podcasts with this um I ate a lot of podcasts with this just because they're so comfortable to wear long term. They're wireless. They're great for calls. Um, so these are like in my house and I use them and I take them when I go and, and travel. You'll see a lot of people on planes wearing Bose headsets. So right. I really like these. The ones that are on sale that are um, the deal of the day are their, this is the 35s, the Quiet Comfort 45s, which I think has a little bit better uh, sound and noise cancellation on them. Those are on sale today, right now a significant d discount uh, for what they normally are, and they're really good ones too. I just didn't need them. I mean, I love Bose, and you can tell that I <laughs> like headphones, uh, but these are so comfortable, and I get the, the replacement pads right from Lowe's, I mean, not, right from Bose, and uh, they're just really, really slick. So, yeah, these are the 35s. If you're wanting some really comfortable head, head um, headphones, the 45s are on sale. It's a deal of the day. Um, don't let this one get away from you because... I wish I would have gone. <laughs> they were discounted. Um, the other ones, if you want to, and you know what, every headphone is different. They fit your head different. People like things different. This is kind of the top of the line uh, from Bose of their wireless noise cancellation. This is another deal of the day that they're having. These are the 700s, and um, they're could, like you do volume with the control up. They've got Alexa. You can have Herbie your assistant with these. These, I think, personally aren't as comfortable as the 35s and 45s but you're gonna have to be the judge of these and um th they look slick they adjust really nice um long battery life i have these in my office and i'll wear these when i have to make long calls or a long zoom meeting or something like that they have the best sound cancellation so if you're really wanting to be like on a plane and drown out those babies behind you i would probably <laughs> get these they're ju I just personally don't think they're as comfortable as the 35s and 45s. So that's just me. Um, uh, so and, and I can't not mention because I, and I'm mostly over ear headphones, which sorry, I'm dropping everything here. Um, and then Heil provided these for both uh, Jim and I. Oh, yeah. These are on ear headphones and I'm usually not a fan of on ears, but these are super comfortable. They're so light that you can barely feel them. And, like, I'll put these on for, I was testing them out, doing a bunch of podcasting and some video editing, and I forgot they were there. And so they're really cool. They've got phase, they've got phase um, 
you can turn that on and off, and it actually kind of helps with ear fatigue. It takes them out of phase, and you, it's not weird sounding like you're going to fry your brain or something, but it uh, it does this little subtle thing, and it kind of helps with like long sessions. I don't know how it works. We had Michelle on, and she talked about it, and I was like, okay. I don't know what she was saying, but it was it sounded <laughs> it sounded smart. And then they comes it comes with three um, sets of chords, so that's really cool. It gives you the chord the the um, the actual um, you know coiled ones and then two straight ones to go to your phone and other stuff. So I can't not mention right. those. So do you have any more headphones? Yeah. Cause I got, I got more Jim. I, I do have, I do okay, have one more. Set, I think okay. um, these are, uh, these are kind of interesting. This, this would be more if you wanted to work out. Uh, let me find it here. In my, in my carousel. These are the uh, Treb lab X three pros. Mm. <clears throat> and so You'll see, right? They come in a set, and uh, of course, they're trying to pair up with something. Hopefully, not this computer. And uh, I think they tell you like one says left, one says right. Um, and so, what I can do? Let me see. I think I got, I got it right. And so, it, so this, as you can see now, oh yeah, those look right good. There. So this would be something that you could exercise in mm -hmm. if you wanted to you know, do a little bit in it. It's definitely not going anywhere once it's in there. Right. Um, it also has a charging case as well. And I think, um, yeah, they, they, they call it uh, true. Yeah. So they, these have a 45 hour battery life and they're IPX seven waterproof, which I think mm -hmm. almost means you could go swimming in them. If go you the shower. Really wanted to do something like that, but yeah. I can't figure out why someone want to do that. Uh, but yeah, these are these are uh, twenty percent off for Prime Day, and uh, yeah, I got these. Uh, I want to say I might have got these around Black Friday. Uh, actually, from I got these from Treb Lab. Uh, so mm. full disclosure, and and they are comfortable. I've used them, um, but I think you know it kind of gets back into. I haven't decided when I'm working out yet. Like when I've been running, it's like, do I really want to wear? stuff because i'm worried about not hearing traffic and things oh, like that so i've got something for you in a little bit so oh um, yeah yeah and yes. those so there's two because i had some more sport headphones that i wanted to talk about too once because I, I mean we did we looked for stuff for you guys to like this is a deal you, you know we have these they're worth it so uh for a long time my workout headphones and walking and running were the bose um uh, sports, one of the, the sound sports, uh -huh. the Bose sound sports, and I. One of the things with earbuds is they really they're hard to keep in. Like a lot of people have complained about the AirPods and they'll fall out when they're running or something. These um, they have these little I call them bat wings. I think that's what they're called. Somehow it keeps them in, and I don't know how. You'd think that something else on there would not, but it really does keep them in your your ear better. Um, and I this is what I use for years and years. And they're on sale and again. Bose is having these great sales right now, um, significantly discounted um, for these headphones. And you can even see, I mean, I, I, like I said, the rubber's a little bit coming off, but they charge, they last a long time. You actually charge them, uh, this little thing pops off and you, there's a little mini USB that you go in there and then you can control it um, by this thing because it wraps around your neck and then you just tap it to the volume to go up and volume go down. So those are great. But the ones, and once again, that I'm using now, and these are also on sale, uh, are the, the uh, um, Aftershocks Aeroplex. And these are amazing. And once again, our friend Chad is the one who uh, introduced me. He's wearing these all the time. Like, these are the most comfortable headphones you'll ever wear. They're, they're bone conduction headphones. And so when it's actually conducting the sound through your, your bone, and it's the weirdest sensation because your ear is open, like um, I'll put them on and you can hear everything because they go and they sit right like where my beard line right in above my above my ears here. And I got the other headphones in too. So it's kind of goofy looking, but um, they sit right there and they vibrate and they, they don't buzz or really anything like that, but they sit there and they conduct that through your bone and you can hear everything when you're walking around. And so I feel so much safer because I go walking and most of the time I'm out in the country on the street and there can be a little bit of crazy driving going on. And right. I can hear them coming. And the sound, they're not going to be like your your super expensive over-ear headphones. But I listen to music on these, and it, it sounds great. And I listen to podcasts. 
But they're so, so comfortable because there's nothing in your ear. There's nothing to get gooky that you have to worry about cleanly, right. cleanliness. One button controls it. You can do calls on this. There's a magnetic charger here on the bottom that mm. you, it's almost like a MagSafe that the Apple used to have where you could click it on there and that's how you charge them up. It comes with two chargers. So I have a charger in my office and a charger in my, um, it's a charging cord in my uh, house. My my daughter tried these on and then stole them, and so I had to buy another pair because she didn't <laughs> like the earbuds because that gave her a headache. But these uh -huh. don't, and they're amazing. I mean, they're seriously amazing. Um, so does it? Will it actually like uh, sync up with your your watch? So like, if you are playing something, you can it's get Bluetooth. The audio. Yeah, so you could do whatever you wanted to. So I um I like I take calls with it. I do all that stuff. Um, there's the the controls for it are on the bottom, and that's how you turn it on and off as well. So, and uh -huh. it's why, and you, I've worn this in the shower. Like I was continuing to, I, I got back from my, my run and walk and I was hot and I still wanted to listen to, you know, Jim Fuse and Chris Stone's Dealcasters podcast. So I just kept this on, jumped in the shower and I actually, when I have to wash my hair, I just hang it up there and then I put them back on because you can pause them. There's only one button on the side, double clicks, you know, advanced track, long click, pauses, plays. But uh, yeah, these are, seriously discounted today it is another prime day deal so put these in your cart you know check these out because this you know this goes away after midnight tonight so these are some of my favorite ones right here oh yeah that that is definitely a nice uh nice price there i'm gonna yeah. have to you'd love them you would you would that. think they're really cool so so what do you cool. got what's up with well, what's, what's next with you so let's, uh, we're gonna go with something i haven't opened yet uh-oh this it's another be... it's another Treb Lab item. It's okay. a uh, it's a speaker, a giant speaker. Um, oh, let me find it here. It is the Treb Lab HD Max, and so as you can see, this is a Bluetooth speaker that you can use um, outside. And they say it's the big, loud Bluetooth speaker. Mm. And uh, getting a little bit of that. What do they call that sound ASMR when you take when off you the, get this. I know I always do it. I think I'm, oh, I'm going to unbox up that I forget my knife. And you're like having to do the, yeah. And so you can see how oh, big this thing yeah. is. And you can, you, you can actually, uh, I guess, do two with them. And uh, it is waterproof. So I want to have cool. it out by the pool, um, have it out by the fire pit. Let me, I'm going to. Is it Bluetooth so you can run it from yes. your phone? Okay. Let's give, you, give everyone the sound of the ASMR. There you go. Right, just like uh, that sound. Oh, oh, I love the good. smell of plastic in the morning. And so you can oh, see yeah. how big oh. this thing is. And it's I got mean, the base at the, the bottom, the big subwoofer thing. Yep. Yeah. And if you're blind, you can tell which is up and down. So that's good. Um, that is really cool. That's going to yeah. tie into something you want to you want to keep this up in your carousel or put it in your go ahead and put it in your cart right now because we're going to talk about some stuff that this would go really well with. Yeah, so this, later so on. this is normally one ninety nine. It's on sale for one twenty nine. Okay, that's a good. So that's deal. a heck of a deal. Um, yeah. I wonder. You know, I always always wonder about. Um, let's see. I, I, my my question is like, is it charged when you first get it? I thought I saw. Yeah. I saw, Ooh, it is. There you go. Wow. So it's ready to go. That is cool. Tear it up. I so I'm a nerd about those kind of speakers too, and I'll tell you why in a little bit later. Ooh, I turned it off. Yeah. Because I didn't, you know, because because now uh, later Facebook's going to say that we were playing music that we weren't supposed <laughs> no. to. No, or showing a movie like you did with the Echo Show. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Yeah. Yeah. I, there was, was another there. another thing. Yeah. So this has got uh, it's 50 watts, 20 hours. Uh, for the the uh, you want to go back to your main screen, or you want to you got something else to show? Uh, yeah, yeah, let's do that. Um, I'm just kind of going back to talk about it, and uh, so it's uh, it has a Type C connector. It's got a carrying strap. I, yeah, so IPX6, which yeah. is you if know, it rains on really, it, you're okay. Yes, yes, and um, yeah, and what was it we were showing earlier was IPX7. I'm trying to remember what that was. Um, one of the other your headphones. I think it was your your head one of your headphones set. 
Your that's right. That's scrolls. right. That was the that was the um, the exercise ones that mm -hmm. I showed the other yeah. Treb Lab item. So yeah, so this is fit thirty five percent off for uh, for Prime Day, and uh, you know three sound modes. It takes uh, I guess it looks like it takes five hours to charge it completely, which isn't bad if you're going to get twenty hours. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, a lot of times I don't know about you. I if I'm done using something, I usually charge it back up just so I don't forget. Right, right. That's the way I am too. Yeah. But, you know, Very probably cool. when you had kids, when they were Does younger. Does it come with an only... app? I mean, I know you just unboxed it, but is there an app um, for it, or is it just a regular speaker that you'll stream to? I'm taking a look here. It's, uh, I think you just Bluetooth it. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Yeah, it, it almost looks as funny as some of the pictures they showed. Like, it looks like a someone's carrying a purse. Um <laughs> So yep. Tim, Tim, you're probably what, so Tim is saying, Hey, Jim and Jeff. Hey Tim. Yes, we are back on live. It's just one of those crazy days. I think you've done the 24 hour one, which I I've just done two yes, in the other did. day. You are a crazy man, my friend, but thank you for uh, stopping by and saying hi over on the Facebooks. So appreciate that. So, um, yeah, it looks like it does everything with um, basically by uh, doing the, Bluetooth, but it mm -hmm. does have a built-in microphone, so you could actually do calls off of it. And you could do karaoke. That's why you do karaoke. Oh, I bet that's what they're saying. So, <laughs> very cool. Because we have something like that, and that's what the kids would use it for. So, very cool. Right. All righty. So, let's go. Um, we've Once again, sales. I was trying to think of things that you guys that would really you need to get while you can. Uh, before our prime day ends and the one i'm thinking about is this right here and i've talked about it i these are amazing this is a two terabyte um yeah let's it's so ch tim says let's add karaoke to the tim and jim show i would i would watch that uh but you might need a hard drive and to store all the the songs in see how i segued that uh that was, good. Um, that was good this is a two terabyte one and it's all solid state so there's no moving parts and these are really super cheap. There's this is the two a terabyte one. You can get um, a, a other sizes as well, but I think this has the best uh, Prime Day deal for it. And this is what I take. A lot of times I'll throw on like files I need to. <laughs> nice, thank you, Tim. Uh, that I'll I'll put on this so I can actually go work. Like if I go to from a hotel or if I'm shooting, you know, video footage and video files are huge, especially with 4K nowadays. And this is what. I'll put stuff on to be safe because you can kind of be rough with this and it's going to be okay. And this is the, the connection here. It's just the USB-C that connects on the bottom right there. Um, and yeah, it's storage. If This is the day to buy storage, folks, if you want to do it. Because the next one I want to talk about, the same kind of deal, is the 16 terabyte one. And that is uh, on my desk over here and I, I can't show it because it's, I don't want to pull it out and unplug something because I think I have stuff that on it, but um, it's a, it's 16. That just blows my mind that you can get that big of a, a hard drive right now, but those are the two best deals I found today on hard drives. A portable one with two, and then a monster kind of book-sized one for your desktop, which is 16, um, and it's like, that one's like half off. Like it's amazing. And, and, how it, much. and even when you say book size, right? Is it is it like about like that? I mean, it's really not. Yeah. They, now you're really, trying to get me to pull it out, and I'm. I, oh, I, I can almost. He, no, I can make it. I can make it. I don't know if this is the one. I think it is. I don't know if it's a sixteen I mean, or I don't not. Wanna, I don't want to break your. It's computer. gonna blame. I'm gonna blame you. So this is it right here. Oh it's, yeah. And so okay. this is the easy store one. I'm not sure it's the exact same size because I have multiple ones on my desk. But this is the what it looks like, uh, and it's a Prime yeah. Day deal. And this does have, it's not solid state like the other one. Okay. This like has a spinning platter and stuff like that, right. but it holds 16 gigabytes. So that's something, you know, when you do video and content stuff or you want to back up your computer, you got to have something like that multiple places. Like I have this, I have a, a network attached storage up on a shelf over here and I use Dropbox. I'm paranoid because I've had stuff crash in the middle of things and it's not cool. Yep. So, yep. Those are Very big, big finds today. So, uh, yeah, I was, I was, I wanted to share that with people because that's um, some good, good stuff that they're having those specials on today. Yeah, it's a big, big deal. Um, while you're searching, Jim, I want to just talk really quick about my next one. Is the uh, is having 
because uh, I was co- controlling the lights. It's another deal of the day. It's the Hue lights that I have up right now, yeah. and we use them in our home. Your Alexa show can control them. Um, the I use them in my office, all my office lights. So I, mine are the color ones, so I can change the colors of those. And they're having a really huge uh, sale right now on the Philips Hue. If you need a hub for it, you can get that. I have a hub here in my office, a hub in the house, and you can switch between them with your Apple device. So if you're looking for deals on lights, you want to stock up. They last forever, too. Like, I've only changed the bulbs in here one mm-hmm. time, and I've had my place for this this uh, set up for over 10 years. So it, they right. last for a long time. So check those out. Very cool. Very so you're cool. Up. All right, so I'm going to go back. This is this was the first, I'll, I'll call it, uh, XLR mic I went to because uh, I used to have have one that shall remain nameless that wasn't XLR. This is the Samson Q2U. This is only seventy dollars right now. And so Ooh. when we talk about getting started with a mic that you can grow with, this is USB and XLR, and so you can kind of see right back there. Right there's the Mm-hmm. Right uh, here is that they got the little connector where you'd put your USB cord. Same thing like you were talking about with the other mics. You can put a headphone in here if you want to listen to it. Um, you know, this is I've seen people will plug this into their phone and they'll kind of go around and, you know, you can interview somebody into your phone if you wanted to do that. Mm-hmm. Um, but I, I have two of these, right? So I, I up until recently, you know, and now, of course, uh, thanks to our friends at Heil, I have I have a I microphone. Have a <laughs> I'm gonna. Ha- I'm, I have to create a microphone uh, museum. I think in my house now. <laughs> or um, storage, at least. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. But these are these are solid. I mean, I can't say enough good things about the Q2U. Is it's you know, if if somebody's gonna ask me, you know, hey, I need a microphone to get started with, and I'm on a budget, this is what I would probably tell them to go with, oh. um, because a lot of times if you're gonna go with, you know, the Shores and the Hiles are are definitely you know, higher end kind of, line, but, yeah. but if you're not ready for that, this is a great way to start. And, uh, you know, it, and it's phantom power, right? So you don't have to worry about batteries. Um, you know, you just plug it in and it works, uh, which I think is, is great. And, and, you know, same thing, right. Dynamic. So mm-hmm. I'm not going to pick up noise in other parts of the house and it, it does come with a pop filter, right? Cause you got to learn to talk across the microphone. Don't talk into the side. Say so talk right. across yeah. it. Um, but this is, yeah, so, the, you know, that this is, uh, you know, a good deal. And, uh, you know, I, I've definitely been happy with that. I, I actually have a Q9U as well, but uh, mm. I've got, you know, I've got to pick a microphone at some point. I know. Well, I think it's good to, sh- I think it's cool to show options to people because we talked about this on multiple shows is how every mic sounds different to other people. And it's what you want to sound like. And the only way you're able to do that is to test out microphones and see the one that you really like. You can get great recommendations for us and that you're like, Oh, that sounded good with Jeff's voice, but you get one and like, Oh, I don't like the way it makes me sound. And you can try another one. So, uh, it's great to have. Yeah, I, I, saw, I saw someone, uh, sent back the, uh, SM seven B cause they didn't like yeah. the way it sounded. Yeah. So it's not unheard of. So, I want to go because I have um, I have one more, and then I want to I want to kind of go in uh, kind of a of like three in a row because they all fit together. But okay. I wanted to talk about really quick because this where did it go? I have so many things in the queue, but it's um, I did a, a product video about it um, not very long ago, and I've had it. I think it was a two year review on it, and it's actually and. People are, especially because they're picking up deals today, is this Logitech iPad case, um, uh. and I've had this. You can there's some like coffee stains on it and stuff, but I love this one. I like it better than the Apple case because one, this is detachable, uh, oh, so nice. you could just do it, and it's got a kickstand on the back, and so you have multiple angles instead of just being stuck with like uh-huh. what um, what Apple gives you, and the keyboard lights up. And you don't have to charge the keyboard. It actually runs off of your iPad. And it's adjustable light. You can have it really dim or really bright. And I just love this thing because of all the options. I I use this all the time. And the other thing that this has that Apple does not have is corner protection. Like, Mm. if you look at the Apple one, like, if you dropped it, you're going to ding up. And I have before dinged up the corners. 
And the only thing after a year, I think two years with this, it's bubbling up a little bit around the speaker. But other than uh, that, I, I, and this is one of the things I use every day. Um, the, the old version had, it used to have a loop that you could slide your pencil through. It doesn't have that anymore. And that's the other thing I, I kind of miss is that yeah. when you put it in your bag, this can slide off. But other than that, this is a, a great case that I, I love, I love typing on it. I'll do, this is what I do in the morning to go through emails is I sit with this on my lap on a pillow and have this out and, and type. So it's very, very versatile having it. So I can sit there and, take this off and watch a movie with this is the iPad pro case, by the way. So I don't know if right. I mentioned that, but I just love this case. And, and, and uh, I just think it's a great value. They're not yeah. cheap, but like I said, two years, the only th- and there's like where it kind of comes up here. There's a little bit of like where kind of looking, but I'm super happy with this. Uh, I would get another one. In fact, I had their first version of this for another I- iPad pro and i'm just i'm sold on their cases so anyway yeah i i actually have one it's called the bridge but it's not on yeah the i watched your review yeah it's, yeah it's a, i I, I really like that in fact i had an issue with mine and the customer service was amazing sent me a new one all i had to do was send them a picture of what was damaged and uh i had one within two days uh, so I, I was really happy with bridge and so bridge does have some things on sale but but the same thing to your point the, it's the pencil is on top with nothing to hold it, and that's yeah, that's the one thing I wish they would add on because I'm always because this I mean these I'm these always, pencils I, are not cheap, um, right. and I'm always like I'll make I have a system now when I put it in my bag I go ahead and take it off and put it in a, a different compartment because of that same reason. Now it's yeah. on there really good, um, and there's it has that cutout for your the top of your iPad, but yep. still you know. I don't know why they took out the loop. I really liked it when there was a loop on there, but whatever. They don't yeah. listen to me. Other than that, I love and this. The, and the bridge doesn't come apart like yours does, so mm. it's it, it really makes it more like you've turned your iPad into a, a, a MacBook. Yeah. You saw the trackpad on there. That's the thing, too, is yeah. I can pinch and zoom and use just like a, an Apple, so that's that's another thing, too. And it is very it's, it's deeply discounted today as well, so make sure you check that out. Yep. All right. What do you got? So let's see. I'm going to go with, uh, I, I guess I'll, I'll stay with uh, microphones a little bit longer. So let me go to my Rode Wireless Go 2. Uh, this mm. is for those of you that are looking to go uh, portable or wireless, I should say. So it comes with uh, two transmitters and then it has one receiver and the good thing about this receiver is it gives you a couple options. I mean, first of all, it is a uh, USB-C to USB-A plug, just so people know that. Um, and then what uh, what I'm able to do, you'll see I've got the, the TRSS adapter. So if I'm going to use this with my phone, I plug this in. Now, it came with this red cable. It just didn't come with the, the part to finish it to go into an iPhone. And so you plug this in the iPhone, and, and like I showed yesterday, I will then clip this onto my tripod if I'm using my phone. And then, you know, these things have a range of 200 meters line of sight. So as an example, if I wanted to go over into the other room where I might have another camera set up and, uh, like, show do a demonstration of the Oculus Quest, which Chris and I have done before, he can still hear me because the audio is still transmitting over here. It's not like I've got to like say, oh gosh, you know, how are you going to get the audio? Because that sometimes is the issue. Mm-hmm. Uh, and you don't necessarily want to have, you know, too many audio sources. You know, if you, right. if I had the audio on on that camera, then you might start having feedback and some other issues. So, uh, but yeah, these, these also record to this uh, receiver so that you can uh, download the audio tracks through the um, through the Road Central app. So if you wanted to, you know, take those uh, audio tracks and you know use it for podcast, whatever, and need to do some treatment of it, that's kind of a nice backup feature that it has. And you know, without having to have a an SD card, just have to remember that 
it only can hold so much. And then I think it starts to overwrite the oldest stuff first. So yeah, uh, yeah. if you want to download it, you make are, sure to do that. Those are really cool. We, when we were talking about those earlier, everybody was chiming in how much they love them and they love uh, having the, the um, lapel mics. And so yep. those, those are slick. Those are slick. So. Yeah. So I, I've used these a lot for uh, doing product videos, especially when I'm not here, but I, going back to your earlier point, Jeff, um, I am definitely thinking about playing around more with the uh, MV88 kit and seeing how I can yeah, maybe yeah. change some things up because I do like that as well. Being able to have it for it when it's, you know, you can go out and capture stuff but also sit in your desk and plug it in for Zoom or whatever is really cool. So, all right. Well, I want to um, kind of move outside because I found some good stuff. I mean, it's so stinking hot in Texas, it's going to be silly to kind of do this. But um, one of the things that I really enjoy is doing – outdoor movie nights we used to do that quite a bit with the kids we have like because they don't have a drive-in theater really around here like i grew up with like i saw star wars in a drive-in theater i remember that was the like i remember that that was cool and i watched like back all the back to the futures in a row in high school and we got out like at four in the morning which is a blast but one of the things i like to do is have outside stuff and this is the solo stove and i think i can get this to work i tried to set up some um I mean, I bought this when they were sponsored on Kickstarter. Um, and one of the oh, cool wow. things about this, it's um, like a fire pit. And those holes at the top, it allows it, it kind of burns off the the smoke some way. And it burns everything almost to ash. So I wanted to show you what it looks like after four years. It still looks okay. It's got like s'more stuff on it. But see how there's hardly any smoke? This is, yeah. um, at, we're, those are my parents and that's my daughter's feet. But it just... You don't need a lot of fuel. It burns up all the fuel, uh, the ashes with it. They start on Kickstarter with a little one where they did, um, they actually did like for, a, there's a smaller one that you can take. This was their big one when I bought it. This is called the Bonfire, but this is like half off right now. And, and these are really wow. nice stainless steel. You can see there's, there's just not smoke. It doesn't get in your face. You can sit there and cook with it. It's a pretty amazing piece of technology, how it works. And so- yeah, yeah, Jeff, I've heard- can you actually like you can actually stick it like say on on a wood yes patio they, and... yeah I I have it on grass most of the time and sometimes the grass is dry I've never had a, a fire with it they have a ring yep. now that you can buy which actually will lift it up even more um, they have a bunch of accessories on Amazon too that are that are on sale that's it, me really getting it going but see how there's no smoke behind there it's just it's yep. just fire and I love this thing this is when it was newer you can see it's not as discolored. I have a cover for it, but I always forget it. But it is under uh, kind of a garage port where we kind of keep it. Uh -huh. But we have another fire pit down kind of in our woods. But this is the one we use because it just yeah. is – it's portable. It doesn't take a lot of fuel, and you don't have smoke in your face all the time. So, so it, bur it burns everything up, so it's not like you have to empty out the ash. Yeah, so you can see here it's kind of like it's it gets these coals, and that will go and just burn until there's hardly any left. And then – there's a there's a grid at the at, when we showed the beginning you saw that kind of holes in the bottom. Um, there's another little compartment under there and you'll turn it over and just dump it out. That's what I okay. do. But it's it's my favorite outdoor thing. Um, and there, there's a, you know when it's not on fire, but you see the holes at the bottom and there's a it's raised at the top and there's I just have a I keep that little prod to do things. This this thing flips over and kind of keeps the um, the uh, fire with the currents and everything so it doesn't you know flare up or anything but it's just i love this stove and it's so cheap today that i just can barely i you know and they just came out with a bigger one and i'm like do i want the bigger one but this is the bonfire so uh if you guys are interested in having this i can't even believe I'm, it's like 103 degrees in texas right now but when it gets cooler this is what we do we sit around it you see my dog That's sleeping right. at the top I, yeah, I, I, yeah I'm, I'm always collecting uh, like wood from trees falling and people yeah. cutting it up. Yeah, I'll take that wood. I can put it in my backyard because yeah, eventually, like you, it's great we'll for hot dogs. Yeah, with TV and yeah, I just, fire. I love this thing. And here's here's the reason why is um, I talked about outdoor movie night and um, the next thing I want to show you guys. I'll go back to this is the and this is on sale as well. The all the nebulas are 
but it's um, it's an outdoor. I use you can use it indoors, but this is an outdoor projector, and it's got a speaker awesome. built into it. Um, there's the front of it. It actually has apps built into it that allows you to um, run Netflix, Android Prime, all this stuff, and project it. It's got a. It's not 2K or anything, but it's like the. I got the Nebula Mars, and they even have a, a bigger model of it now that is that's even brighter. But for outside movies, this thing's amazing because it has a speaker built into it. You can put it on top of a tripod, and you've got a oh. remote control, and so. I set this up outside, and we have movie nights. And what you can do also with it, and Jim, going back to your big um, uh, speaker thing that you had, your portable speaker, you can actually connect wireless speakers to it. And so I have the same thing that I use. These can be a little too, I want, like when I'm watching Star Wars, I want some bass. I want some loud right. stuff outside. And so I'll have those external speakers instead and have this plan. And it's so much fun. And it's it, you can plug it in, or you can have it uh, have a there's a battery built into it, so you can run it just like a lot of people take this camping and they'll just set it up and they'll throw a sheet up out on the campgrounds and they'll the whole campsite will you, watch do movies. Do you use a sheet or do you have like a? Um, oh yes, like, uh, but uh, I want to talk about so there's this one. This is the the um, the Mars two, but they also have a canister one that's also a Prime Day deal. If you want a smaller footprint. You can get that one as well. A lot of people like the the smaller one too because they can take it. They'll put it in their kids' room when they have sleepovers or whatever. So all of the uh, the uh, these Nebula ones, and I think these are built by Anchor, and um, they're oh. a division of the Anchor company. So it's really cool. So when you ask what screen is, no, I have a outdoor screen, and there's another Prime Day deal right now for a 120 inch uh, outdoor screen that you set oh, up wow. just like I do. And it's only, uh, it's $59, but it's wow. 120 inches. This thing will, you back it up and you can fill it with it. It's bright enough to do, um, at night. And so that I kind of, I, so I put all this stuff together because I was like, I wanted to share my love of outdoor movies and this is just, you could get everything you need. Yeah. Well, here. I'm almost wondering, like you were saying, if you can, uh, if it'll take apps, um, yeah. I wonder, could you, let me ask you this. Do you think you could like put your iPad or your, um, I've Apple? run it off. Yeah. I've run it off my phone before for different things. Yeah. Ah, you can plug yeah. in your phone and run and do airplay if you want. There are some limitations with some things don't stream across, but there's ways to work around it. Like I bought one of your, uh, fire, the fire sticks and plugged it in yeah. and used it that way. Because something there's there's something, but there's always workarounds. Because they have apps built in the interface, and there is another one that you couldn't do. But I use the Netflix that's built into this. I use the Prime that's built into this. Um, you can hook up a DVD player because there's an HDMI port okay. in there. So there's a USB port, and then there's the HDMI. There's where you plug in your extra power, and then there's an audio out too. So if you wanted to wire it, I usually use the Bluetooth thing, and it connects Bluetooth to this, I don't have to plug in a wire. So I could put in mm -hmm. your, your your Bluetooth speaker and it would have plenty of bass. I usually set that at the bottom of the screen and have an awesome movie night. So wow, these are really, really cool. I really like these. And it, here's the remote that it comes with too. So you can sit back and you control the sound. It's just kind of your standard, kind of almost looks like an Amazon remote control or yeah. Roku. There's that and then the screen. And then of course, You've got to follow it up with what movies are you going to watch? And these are a Prime Day special, too. These are half price. And forget the last movie, but these are 4K. They're doing a special. I think it's Paramount's doing right now uh, special. And I got this one because it's got – Paramount Plus is, like, taking stuff off. Like, I wanted to watch one of the Indiana movies the other day, and it was gone from Paramount Plus. I'm like, dang uh -huh. it. So I'm like, I'm never going to have that happen again. So this is the 4K Ultra. It comes with the digital. But there's a ton of them right now on sale and how can you go wrong with indiana jones and harrison ford I'm you just, can't i just can't. that's Classic. yeah so that's my outdoor movie uh extravaganza uh prime day deals and those are all prime so yeah those are really really cool very cool well i've got a i've got another uh i guess you could say uh, especially if, if you've been exercising jeff you you might need Right. A massage gun. Oh, I have one of the, I, that. May be the same one I have. That's the, tur the Turonic. 
I don't know. It's, My kids uh, got it to me for Father's Day. Yeah, so it's it's uh it's on a deep discount, almost uh, and lightning deal too. There's 83% claim because probably people are claiming it as I'm opening it. So I was excited to get this. Um, this is I think this is actually related to the Treb Lab people because they sent this to me, and uh, you know this is something I've I've wanted for a while because uh, you know when you get a lot of these cheaper massage things they, they don't necessarily right. work as well as you'd like. So yeah, you see it comes in a nice case. Right. And uh, you oh, got, yeah. uh, you know. They really got, do work. They really do. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, especially with all the all the running I'm doing, I know I need to, to do that, so. Because your got, stilettos, they hurt when you, when you run them. With... <laughs> They've got, I think it's got eight different heads mm -hmm. um, that come with it. Yeah, so it's got, uh, yeah, it'll do, uh, yeah, five speeds, seven massage heads, and it's a handheld percu percu percussion massage gun. So, and it's interesting I'm, the heads on those good. really do work different muscle groups. When you read like what you're supposed to use it on, like there's one yeah. usually for your foot and like your shoulders. Yeah. Yep. So this will be this will be my new yeah because I definitely need to work my uh, my my uh, leg muscles. I can feel that they're tight from all the mm -hmm. exercise that I've been doing. I, so mm -hmm. when I was doing a lot of walking, I get the plantar fasciitis, you know, yeah. and I would run that on my heel and the kind of the arch and that would really, mm -hmm. really help. So, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Nice case. I mean, this is, you know, can uh, take this, you know, look at you with all the unboxings. It, it, That's pretty cool. I know. So, you know, nice little handle. And so, yeah, so this is a great deal. Yeah. 44% off. So if mm -hmm. you want a nice massage gun, right, you don't want a cheap one. Uh, definitely something you might want to, uh, to consider. Um, yeah, that's a good point with the whole, uh, oh, this, this is funny. Uh, I, well, I probably shouldn't say it could be a health claim and then they'll shut us down, but yeah, don't do that. what they see on their pictures is kind of funny, but, uh, yeah, we, so figure that one. Jim, you may want to add this one. If you want to go back to your thing that I'm going to show right now, because I think it's, it's one of those secret, not secret, but one of these awesome deals that I found that I know that you have one too, and you'll probably want to add it. But right now, they have a, a sale going on where not only do you get it at a, a cheaper rate, but you also get a $25 gift card, and that is the Oculus Quest. Um, so there's Whoa. a special right now going on that if you get an Oculus Quest, and there, it's, a, it's a sale for, I think it's their, their, the one that has the most hard drive space on it, uh, you get a $25 Amazon gift card on top of that. And so that, that must be, yeah, I didn't see that yesterday. That must be a today. Deal. I just saw it when I was going through and I'm like, Oh, I know Jim. When I, now I have this comfort strap on it that probably that won't come too. with it. That has the battery in the back. And one, that's it. really, it is really worth it, but ignore that. Cause that's not, I don't think you get that with this. You get the regular strap, but you do get a $25 uh, gift card from Amazon and you can probably go find this uh, and uh, get that as an add on. But if you've been wanting to get an Oculus or your kids have been wanting to, I guess they're called Meta now, the Meta Quest yes. or whatever, Meta or whatever yeah. it sounds like. Johnny Quest. No, it's the Meta <laughs> Quest. Um, this is the time to get one because it's on sale and you get that $25 off. And, you know, you think, what is these old guys on Oculus? But they're, it's pretty amazing. Until you've strapped one of these on your face, it's hard to describe the cool stuff you can do. Like when have it you got, played uh, Supernatural yet? Yes. I have that one. I I subscribe for that one for a little bit, but the one I do now is box. It's the boxing one. It's called Fit VR, um, oh. and I do the boxing because sometimes it rains or it's too hot, um, and it you are sweating up a storm, and it's a lot of fun. It's almost like Beat Saber, but a little bit more uh, structured and intense for workouts. Uh, your kids will love Beat Saber. I've been playing a Jurassic Park game because I'm a big fan of Jurassic Park movies uh, in here. Mm -hmm. I've watched movies in here. If you've never, there's an app called Big Screen uh, VR, and it's a free one. But they actually, you can rent VR movies and go watch them with your friends in there. And the cool thing about watching 3D movies in Oculus is it's like you're in a theater because they have the dynamic lighting, so things reflect off of, like, the, the seats around you. But you don't have, like, if you've seen a 3D movie before, you have those, those glasses which kind of dim the movie. You don't have that in Oculus because it's already in 3D. And you can watch those movies like I watched Galaxy's, I mean, uh, 
Guardians of the Galaxy the other day in Oculus. Um, I did a lot during when we couldn't go out to movies. I would watch the stuff in here, and it felt like I was in a movie. But, yeah, today they have the Oculus uh, with the $25 gift card on top of the sale. So uh, make sure that you add that because that is a, a cool thing. So, Jim, do you want to say anything else about this? Because I know oh, I, I love it. the Oculus. I, I mean, uh, when you're starting to think about Web3, won't even go into mm-hmm. everything else, this is kind of the – the first step, but I will tell you what I'm interested to see because I, and I know you've probably been following it as well. There are some other companies that are making these type of devices. But what is nice uh, for those of you that are worried about Meta, I believe it's next month. You will no longer be required to have a Meta account to use right. Oculus. Right. You won't have to have a. a it's Facebook. It's every still says yeah. Facebook. They want us to say Meta, but whatever. Zuck. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so that's cool if you're worried about having to do that. And there's plenty of apps. You can actually stream it to your phone or to your TV. So if you have uh, kids that you're a little worried about, because it's hard to you can't see what they're seeing, uh, but you can have it cast to your phone or your Android device and check out if they're, if they're playing some games that you want to make sure they are. But there's a lot of cool stuff in here. Um, yeah. There's Star Wars Vader uh, Unleashed or Unlimited or something, but it's... It is so freaky when Vader looks you in the eye, like he's looking <laughs> at your eyes, and he's just and it's and it's got it's so much fun he to play you. yeah. if you're if you're a Star Wars fan. So yeah. uh, if you want to get those, check out the Oculus or the yeah the Meta Oculus Quest is what it is. So um, anyway, what else you got, Jim? All right, so this is a crazy device, and I I've actually still got to learn to use it. But this is the um, oh cool the DJI RSC two. Cool. This is a major, major. That's for a heavy duty camera. It'll actually work with the Sony uh, ZVE ten. That's the main reason I got it because at some point I want to start using that. But you can see, yeah, this thing is uh, built like a tank. You know, you've got the ability to, you know, go kind of uh, if we're going to call it. Uh, I'm breaking my. Thing. you can see the handle that here is, yeah, it is up. that is heavy and they make good they make good gimbals they're like the yeah. top of the line yeah i had i had the other the 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 osmo 2 i think before mm-hmm. this mm-hmm. i actually still have it but this was i did specifically got this to start doing stuff with the uh with the camera i just that's uh it's on my list of things to do you know we're both guilty of that more mm-hmm. things to do than we than we right. should, but you can just see it's got all kinds of adjustments you can make and measurements, and uh, you know. So I'll have to take a class, and then maybe I'll make some YouTube videos, like uh, Professor Nez, who is uh, watching over oh, on hey. my. Hey, Great to see Professor. him. Yes, I know. How, and, and, and Nez, how has your uh, Prime Day been? Is it has it gone well with your uh, with your shows? I know he did a couple shows, and uh, so I'll go back to mm-hmm. solo mode. But yeah, so this is this is on sale. Um, you know, I know it's not cheap, but you know, it is a discount. So if you're looking right. for, for a good gimbal, you know, I know a lot of people are getting into cameras as opposed to their phones. Uh, good thing to have. Yeah. I, I love my, I, I have the, the smaller version of the Osmo five with the extension and I really like that one. So, uh, one of the things and I don't have it in front of me, uh, cause I actually gave it to my parents, but Jim, I know you have, uh, you've talked about this a lot as well. And there is a significant deal on all the Roku streaming sticks. Um, yeah. If, and so if you're wanting to, like I have a smart TV, so I'm like, I have Roku built into my, my TV, but my parents don't. And so I have gotten her one of the, one of those and they, they use that. They love it because it's easy to use. It's not super hard. It's, it's the 4k one, but I have that in the carousel because Jim introduced me to it and I got it for my parents. And I, um, I think it's a wonderful deal. And it's like, it's like almost half off right now. So, if you're looking for a stick to stream stuff with, look at the Roku. Um, yeah. Let's see. The other thing that I, and so like, once again, I just, we scoured and it's kind of random stuff, but uh, I kind of like gaming. I haven't been able to game as much as I have wanted to, but right now there is a prime day deal, uh, day deal on the uh, death adder gaming mouse. And I have one and it changes oh. colors and I like it because you can actually uh, uh, really quick, like if sometimes you want to have like really fast mouse responses, you can uh-huh. adjust it right there. You got a mouse wheel. It looks cool. This is actually attached to my gaming computer, which is also my streaming computer over here on my right. But um, 
very, very cool mouse. It's got the side buttons you can uh, program very fast. It is a gaming mouse. It is wired um, because one I like for gaming stuff, I like to have it wired because I think you get a little bit more fast response time. But these are on sale significantly right now too. This is the the Prime Day deal. The Death one. It sounds cool. It's a Death Adder. <laughs> but you can you can change the colors. I have it just cycling through right now. I just like it sitting on my desk, kind of making those colors. But yeah, so this is another. So do you have great. a do you have a gaming desktop or laptop? It's a gaming desktop. So I got it like you. I was going to use VMix, uh, and I did use it for a long time until I uh, got hooked on Ecam, and. Uh, but I still, I mean, I still use it. Like I'm casting from there all our backgrounds that you're seeing, like motion uh-huh. stuff. So it doesn't bog down my computer because I have an older iMac. But uh, I still game on that one because it is a, uh, it's an Alienware. It's a gaming. Oh, computer. nice. So that is definitely, yeah, uh, yeah. Because I, I bought what I have is a Rogue Amoeba mm-hmm. with a really high end. Uh, what's the Nvidia card in it? And yeah. Bunch Stuff. It was hard to find those cards for a while. They're starting to come back, but uh, it was hard to find. I lucked into it right before all that mining stuff happened with Bitcoin and everybody trying to get those cards. So, but yeah, yeah. this is a fun, this is a great mouse. I really, really like it. So that's nice. Yeah. Cause I, I use the, uh, I have the Logitech uh, MX3 Master for my yeah. Mac. And, and I, in fact, it was funny when you mentioned wire. It's like, oh, yeah, I probably should plug in. And charge my because even though it goes you know wireless for i don't right, know days or months on end every yeah. once in a while i'm like parent like oh yeah i probably should plug that in because right now would be the time it would decide to stop working <laughs> i know i've had it i've had the warning before when i'm doing a live show like your apple mouse is like hey it's you only at five percent i'm like dang it give me a better warning than that um so what else you got are you getting down to the wire i'm getting close uh, i think i'm close i think i have uh let me look i think i might have one more thing i haven't brought well i've got a couple things i mean i did the uh the and i've got it down here the um i'll kind of show it from back here so this is the ub size i was talking about yesterday so as you can see it comes with this ability you can fit your iphone android phone and it'll just automatically switch what i like about it too and i use this sometimes for product video shooting Mm -hmm. because like and, and you can also take this out if you want to put in a camera uh, so it'll right. go you know it comes with this so it's not like you have to get spend extra for it but i like how it'll tilt mm. right and so not only can i tilt it um you know i can also if i loosen this i can also go other directions so you can get some different angles um off of this and then it's also got this ability yeah, the here sun, yeah that's really you nice know, hang, hang some weight on there if you're worried of you know in a windy area and it is this will go up to 67 uh inches so it, it's taller than me um and uh but and then you know the the feet move which is nice so you can be on some uneven ground it's just really solid and when you look at the price it's about uh i mean i, I can give you the exact percentage i'll click on the thing here it is uh 25 off oh that's prime cool. Yeah, and I, I and I bought this last Prime Day, and it's become my go-to um, tripod when I'm out doing stuff. And uh, it also comes with the uh, clicker if you wanted to, um, you know, be able to like you know, program the like, the auto thing on your phone right. uh, to do that. I always forget to do that. <laughs> you know, and, up, and I really don't think you can have it. Um, especially with the camera stuff you're doing live streaming and producing shows, you can really not have an, enough tripods. I mean, maybe you can have too many, but I mean, I'm always like, Oh, my kids stole that one. I need to get another one. Like they'll take my little ones for their little projects and stuff. So, uh, yeah, I think that, that finding a good tripod on prime day is, is really, really cool. So, all yeah. right. Um, I've got a couple more and I'm kind of going to the fun zone with this one. Um, and it actually, has um it's a let me go it's got um like there's only 43 claims so it's it's starting to actually you know you, you, one of those lightning deals where you want to get it while you can and it is the holy stone 440 and it's like a trainer oh. it's like a trainer um uh drone like my daughter i have another drone and she gets really nervous with it and i understand and like this one is supposed to be really easy. It has gesture control on it, but yeah, it's um, 
it was a, it was there was a lightning deal going on this, and I don't know if it still is. It shows it on my on my iPad, but I don't know if it still does. Um, but this is significantly di discounted. So if you want to have some fun outside, um, yeah, it's, st it's still on sale at the moment. Okay. I see. I'm, yeah. I'm looking at your page. Yeah. So I think it's a good it's a good deal. This is a great one. I think for starting out, it's got an HD camera. You can have it circle fly with some gestures. Um, this one I have not taken out yet to, I was going to do an unboxing with it because I have another one that I do like. And this is, um, this is actually the, um, another one that's on sale right now. And these, these have like gone like hotcakes over on, um, on these the prime day. And so they were actually sending me the numbers that they had. Um, just, and this is the, HS 175D, and I did take this out and fly it. Um, it performs really, really well. It's got the camera here on the front. It's got the HD camera. Um, it's, and I, I know everybody compares them to the DJI's, but these, like, this is one my my daughter flew, and it comes with a controller where you can actually put on your phone at the top, so she's able to look at that. Um, but yeah, it's a great, another great starter drone. This one has GPS, so you can actually track it compared to the other one. And so and it's got the auto land stuff. And so we took it out and flew it and had, had a blast with it. I'm not going to say if it get, did go in the neighbor's yard or not, because we don't want to talk <laughs> about that, but I was able to retrieve it with the GPS going over and, and finding it. But uh, this is a good one to, 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 uh, to practice with. There, it comes with two batteries and the batteries actually just uh, come out right here. And it's got that camera on the bottom too. So it senses the ground, um, and kind of right. has some avoidance collision stuff on it. But uh, this is a, another great starter drone. It folds up pretty compact. So it's it was fun. It's fun to fly. So yeah. I don't know if you have any drones, Jim. I, but, I uh, did. Get, I actually have a Holy Stone drone as well. It's, yeah. um, I think I've got, I might have one of the ones you have in your carousel. I might have the, 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 well, is it the 4K one? Yeah. It's, I mean, <laughs> I would have killed for this stuff when I was a kid. It's like I'm an adult now. I'm like, I can finally, I can have, because they had model airplanes when I was a kid, and these are right. so much easier to fly, and the price point's lower. I mean, a, a, a drone with a camera on it at this price is just amazing if you think about it. I mean, it really yeah. is. And so, yeah. yeah, it's just it's just a lot of fun, and it's pretty have compact. You, have you gone and got your, um, your, your pilot's license yet? No. Do you have a pilot's license? Uh, no, I haven't oh. done it yet. That's probably why, because I, I know a guy uh, that I know locally that that's what he does for a living, and I guess they're starting to crack down on people that... Uh, oh, so I, I am licensed with the FCC. Like, I grandfathered yeah, in yeah. when I when I got my first drone, so Good. I don't have the one where I can go and do commercial stuff. Like, I okay. can't go to realtors and yeah. film for them and the, the, the houses. Now, I don't think it's that hard to get one, but... Um, you have to put like your number in it and the, mine has a certain thing and I have an airport not very far from me and it warns me. And so they're, they, they're, they're, it's cool how safe they're becoming, but they're also, it's really fun that you can fly them. So that was my, yeah. I have like two more. So what do you got? Uh, Mr. Fuse? The, I have, uh, I, I kept it out because I knew it was still on sale. I've got the, um, the focus, right. Oh you know, yeah. Yeah. Aren't ready for, uh, to go to the level of the um the the roadcaster this like i said i've had this for probably at least three years uh you know because this became my interface when i got the uh the samson you know because i could plug it right in now this too the reason why i, why I went with the 2i2 and this is a third gen is you can put two microphones in. So mm -hmm. we all didn't know what was going to happen. But what I, I was at a conference, and this is what really caught my attention, is this person was having four people because they have ones that have more than two mic inputs. And so each person had their own separate audio. Mm. And as you know, right, if you're doing a podcast, that's important to have separate audio tracks. Right. And you can control the gain for each of the microphones right here on the interface so you don't have to like go mess with your computer you can also plug in a headphone so you can kind of hear what's going on so yeah i i still use this with my laptop and i will probably use this uh when i travel yeah and that was the other thing when i saw you in lima 
Jeff, I did not have the road yet, so this was not didn't uh, okay. go with me. That would have probably solved my problem that I had when I was mm-hmm. just trying to live stream natively in a sense off of my uh, older MacBook. But these are these are solid. You know, Focusrite is a great company. Um, I definitely recommend this if you're looking to get into an interface. It does come with software that will allow you to do some other things with your with your audio. Uh, and then it's got a USB-A uh, connector to go into your computer for those of you that are, you know, maybe concerned about that. Um, but yeah, so it's, uh, it's about, it's, it's on sale as well. The, um, the, the solo, I think that's what they call it, which is just for one, that's even got a bigger discount for prime day. And, uh, I know Ross had a show today where I think he was talking about mm-hmm. focus rights got a, is it a microphone they've come out with or something? Oh, I haven't seen that. I didn't see him say what that. Did, so. what did he, uh, let me find what he was talking about today. That was cool. He was, he was talking about something. But Focusrite makes great stuff. I mean, they're they're great, solid interfaces. I don't know anybody who's had one like just like stop on them. I don't. I think you know they just keep working. Right. So it's kind of a standard piece of hardware. All right, yes. I've got two more. Let me get my stuff ready. Oh, it's called the Vocaster Two Audio Interface. Oh. That's what they came out with. I'll have to check about Ross. Crazy, crazy looking thing. All right, so I just made a video about this the other day and this one is once again significantly discounted and it is a prime day uh, deal it is the d i think it's dr drc i can't i never know how to say it right d drc rc car and this is a fun car um we took this out my daughter i was gonna give it to my nephew and my daughter goes no i want it you can't give it away so it's got a camera on the top that syncs to your phone and so um, I have some, I think I can play it. Let me go to this right here. We're going to have to switch to a different. Um... Okay. Um, no, it's want me to update system audio, so I'm not going to do that. So um, what we were doing is actually, we were actually going in. I have some footage. If you go look on my uh, product video where we snuck up on the cat with the camera and it was pretty funny. Because, you know, they couldn't figure out what this thing was, um, and we were driving it around. But it's, if you go to jeffc.live, you'll see the um, – let me put, pull that up for people. Um, you'll see that where I took it, and you can see all the different footage. The thing is – and here's the controller right here. It's um, It works really well. It's quite a place for your phone to go on it. So you can actually see the camera, and you can actually drive this whole car with your, with your phone. It's got oh, – wow. You got your variable speed right here where you can, um, you know, go fast or go in reverse if you push it forward. It's, this is where you can steer it to. One of the things is it's variable speed, but it's not variable steering. So it's all left or all right, which is fine. But just if you give it to your kids, let them know. It's got really good shocks on it. We were doing it off-road. comes with two batteries. So you can have one charging, one, uh, you know, inside of the machine. This takes four AA batteries at the bottom. But I just thought it's a really great deal for if you have kids or grandkids. Yeah. This is a great one to start out with. Uh, you're on and off right here. The only thing I would I would say to warn people is that uh, the screw. So it's got a battery cover, but it, they're screwed in, and they're not. They don't. You know how some of the battery covers have where the screw will actually stick in the stay there when you take it out. Yeah. These are loose, so these could I think easily uh, get yeah. lost. The same on the bottom right. of this. So either put some tape on them or, you know, take them out for your kids until they get used to it. That's what I would do. The same thing, this camera comes off. So if your kid's like really learning for the first time, I'd take the camera off. So if it rolls, you're not dinging up the camera. Um, it is a high definition camera. The only thing is you got to remember you're on a, um, a, a bouncy car. So your camera footage, if you're going really fast, <laughs> is pretty shaky, even on uh, smooth services. But going slow and like I saw a guy in the comments actually has this to go under. He's like a plumber or something. He drives under houses so he can oh, uh, wow. look at because this is you can angle this up. Um, mm-hmm. And so he can he uses it in that way, which I'd never heard of. But it's just fun car and the camera kind of has some added stuff to it. So I thought, uh, you know, if you want to see all the footage we shot in the cats, you can go to Jeff C uh, dot live. But uh, I just I thought it was it's a great deal. It's on sale right now. Um, good Christmas gift for young ones, but it was fun. That's a fun thing. So. Right. 
Yeah. So our friend uh, Mario from Shore is uh, over oh. on my channel. So, so Mario, gonna gonna do something special for you. We uh, actually have this in the carousel. So I'm using my Shure MV7, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna do a mute here. You've got the Super 55 that I'm now talking into. So I see if you wanna you can see how nice it sounds. Oh, let me go to let me go full screen here. Sorry, I was. Yep clicking on stuff yeah look at that that got the super 55 so it did get here so thank you mario for that and uh yeah sure's got some great deals so uh, we've been talking about them earlier the uh the aonic freeze and the uh the mv you know, the mv88 the that is my favorite i we've talked a lot about that um i love the sound of that and thank you mario for for sending that to me as well because um that is probably my favorite thing in the world right now for I can take it with me when I travel. It's got live video stuff on it. So big shout out to sure for, for sending that stuff yeah. to us because, uh, and I showed them, you know, how to take it apart, put it together. It's just, and it sounds really cool. So thank you so much for that. That's, that's really, I, awesome. I, feel, I feel like I'm going to have to go get a hat and look like Chad now though. When I use that. I know you are. Cool. Yeah. I like it. He might be jealous though. He, I thought he had something like it. Does he not have that microphone? Because I thought he did. He, he definitely has a mic with that look, but right. I'm not sure what it is. Okay. Yeah. But, uh, so. yeah. He he's he's having a he's he's on a on a trip. Good for him and uh, yes. Laney having having some fun. So. All right, my last one, and I I had B roll, but I something happened with the camera, um, and it's my big daddy. Um, my grand, my dad uses this all the time, and it's the it's in the carousel just highlighted right now. It's the uh, Breville Bristol uh, um, um, Barista Express, and it's significantly cheaper today. Oh, it's the oh. high end cappuccino maker. He is an artist when it comes to this, and uh, I had some B roll of him actually making, and I'll I'll add it to a product video later, but um, of him making this really fancy hazelnut chocolate latte for my uh, daughter and it, this thing is it's it's pro level it's just really good and you hardly see oh, it yeah. discounted and it's it's really nice frost the coffee it uh you know he put he grinds the beans right at the top it goes into the espresso mold he tamps it down he has the pressure gauge to know exactly how much pressure to use um it is amazing it makes incredibly good coffee and he loves it and he tink and he doesn't buy like expensive stuff but he loves this thing. So that's my last one is the, the nice. Barista Express from Breville because once again, we scoured the interwebs on Amazon trying to find deals for you. And this was another great deal that we thought, uh, you know, might as well yeah. throw it out there. Yeah, I mean, you know, it, it's too bad that Prime Day is not every day, but I guess. <laughs> yeah, we, we'd be busy, Jim, we'd be really busy. <laughs> but, so. there, but it, you know, we're, we're hearing rumors that, uh, there might be another one in October, so uh, I have a feeling that's going to happen because it's yeah. going to, you know, it's going to be a, a big time for people. And they did one that time last year with the lockdown, didn't they? Do one in October? Didn't they move it from July into October? Well, no, actually, we did it in June, uh, but they did do some things. They, yeah. Um, yeah, they'll do, they'll they'll have other things coming up, and then of course you got the whole. Uh, Holiday season is a lot of sales usually mm -hmm. around the week of Black Friday. Um, those are those are usually big days as well. Right. Um, but you know, and, and and like I I think like we talked about, kind of hearing feedback from people. I think uh, it seems like some companies held off from getting involved in doing discounting for this. I don't know if they're waiting. Um, yeah. yeah. So well. bye bye bye. JK says every quarter. Uh, that would be nice, but maybe that's what they're starting, but, uh, yeah, we'll see. But thank you guys for hanging with us. Uh, Tim Sohn and, uh, uh, Mario from sure. And everybody who stopped by and, uh, let's see, uh, Laura Williams and, and Jim for doing this for me. This has been a lot of fun. It's wrapping yeah. up folks. So if you put anything in your cart, you need to check it out. I think I have some stuff that Jim talked about that I need to go. And uh, actually, put got, yeah. So, thank goodness for Pacific time. So, I think right. we're gonna look at yeah. uh, right. We've got we've got uh, a couple three more hours and twenty two minutes to to get some deals. I know because I'm thinking about that uh, that two terabyte hard drive you were talking I'm about. I'm telling. So, I got that one the last Prime Day deal, and like my Stream Deck, I've I've gotten those. 
So yeah, it's um, you know, I think it's it's cool to pick up stuff that you need because live streaming and podcasting, you always need that. We've given you some great options on microphones. Like the, there are almost all of them are on sale today. So uh, if you're wanting to up your podcast game or your live streaming game, make sure you do that. You know, um, sh- uh, thanks for all the people who sent us stuff to review. Um, there's product videos coming. There's stuff that's already on dealcasters.live of reviews. There's stuff on jeffc.live with reviews. So check those out if we went too fast or you want to dive in deeper. Um, so <laughs> last, as, as we're wrapping up, we have some people popping in. Um, we've got, uh, let's see, Rob Strathen says, hey, fellas. Hey, Rob, to you. Yep. Good to see you. Um, yeah, so um, this has been fun. I can't wait to do it yeah. again. I like yeah. doing this dual thing that we do. Where we yes. kind of versus like, what did you find? Well, I found this. So I know we of, didn't. We neither one of us told the other when, and I didn't go try yeah. to look for your your show, so I had no idea. Yeah. I, 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 when you put when you threw that challenge down, I was like, gosh, I really got to go find some, some go find stuff. some deals. Well, the funny thing is, a lot of the stuff we 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 saw together, and like we had the sure microphones, and we did a bunch of the other like the hard drives we talked about, the Oculus. You know, you did a great review that's on your channel about that of the oculus so yeah tons of great stuff so make sure that uh, as we wrap this up that you guys follow um if you're watching on jim's channel head over to mine at jeffc.live if you're watching on jeffc.live head over to dealcasters.live hit that follow button because that helps us out a ton um and lets amazon know that you like our streams you like what we're doing lets the brands that give us stuff to review know that we are legitimate and we and we love to make product videos and and uh, talk about this stuff on live. So I appreciate everybody. Jim, I'll let you have the final word. Yeah, no, Jeff, I, I appreciate you. Uh, let me join you since my uh, partner in crime <laughs> decided to take a vacation during the uh, mm-hmm. you know, Christmas in July, but that's okay. Cause I know he's having a good time and that's, yeah. you know, and it's good to, it's good to be on vacation. So I, and I'm looking forward to, uh, to us hanging out next month in uh, right. podcast. Yeah, and that'll be my first time I've ever, done more than fly through the dallas airport i hope that it's not that hot because we were black and we'll just burst into flames if we walk outside <laughs> is what will happen it really but that, you know there's some fun stuff and some of our friends are going uh that will be there too and it's going to be just a week of uh nerding out a lot of the people who we did reviews for so if you're going to be in dallas or you're on the fence about podcast movement a lot of the vendors that we talked about today like heil and sure and some other ones will be there that you can actually go up and we talked over and over because we did so many mic reviews about testing them out with your voice. They have them set up there where you can walk up, put on headphones, and talk and say, oh, I really like the Shure or I really like the Finn. And you can make some decisions there at Podcast Movement and, and test them out. And the vendors are amazing. Uh, there are going to be a lot of them. So make sure you head over there. Yep. And I said you yeah, had the last so, word uh, and then I talked. Go ahead. No, no, you're good. You're good. Th- thanks, everybody. And Make sure you guys, uh, if you're going to buy something, you've only got three hours, 18 minutes, and it's, it's going fast. But, uh, you know, right. uh, we appreciate any, any uh, support, you know, and uh, it's fun to get to do this. And I, I'm surprised more people don't. But, uh, and you can also, if you're not following us here, you know, we're on, uh, we're on YouTube. We're on, we're on all the tubes, I think. Uh, <laughs> you know, and Jeff is the manly Pinterest guy. So if you want to even go yeah. on Pinterest, you can find some, some, some stuff, stuff there. there. Yeah. All right, folks, see you, see you around, see you next time. We'll see you next Prime Day, too, but uh, thanks for watching. Bye, everybody.